deny ya Make all the demons quiet yeah. We were built to thrive, yeah I think that we've all had enough What keeps you up at night, yeah Make all the demons quiet, yeah We were built to thrive, yeah Yeah. That's right. Yeah. That's right. We're taking a page out of what we do with MTW. And also, not just that, the chat's a little different now, too. Um, Y'all guys will probably see it in the stream soon. I'm not really sure if it's going to go live. Um, but pretty much uh, change some stuff. We even have like a little alert when people actually subscribe to the channel. So that's actually going to be pretty cool. And we... I did some minor things. That was the reason why I was even changing the time to probably 5.15. But with that said, real quick. We're good, we're good. Real quick though, just in case. Listen, listen. You put me in the middle of left and right. <laughs> <laughs> I don't even know what the fuck you said. <laughs> you put me in the middle of Twiddle D. Guess you put me in the middle of what, Twiddle D, D and Twiddle Guess no. what? Oh. D yep. Guess what? I Guess know. what? What? <laughs> Hey, Dima, guess yeah, what? Yeah, Dima, yeah, guess yeah. what? Dima, guess what? And see, and see, I got no escape because Cyclone's down here, so I can't, I can't do, you know. <laughs> you fucking know it. Yeah, yeah, you can't run away. Who does say you're running away? No, no, you're stuck here. You're fucking stuck here. Chicken butt. Guess who? Guess who? Chicken God, fuck. Chicken boo. Guess why? Maybe concerned about y'all. Guess why? Maybe actually concerned about y'all. You say, oh, you say cheese balls, or is that, is that not a, is that not a lot? <laughs> no, we're all good, we're all good. But either way, oh, uh, like that said, like, like balls? poor D-Mob. Let's see, actually, you know what, I want to see if the chat's actually working, because, uh, I know I updated the chat, I just don't know if it's actually working. Because, uh, it's been a while since I've updated the chat. There it is, there, there it is. Right yep, there's the middle. The that's our new right. chat. It's a little, it's a little chat box to where now the chats will be in little boxes. Why? I don't fucking know. I honestly don't know. I'm gonna see how it plays out. Um, if it, I see it. It looks fine. I don't. Um. Uh, <laughs> God damn it. But that's what I was gonna say. The, the, the chat box is gonna be like a, it's gonna be a test one. Censoring yourself is hard. I'm sorry to those in the audience. Ah. Uh, sorry to those in the audience who aren't allowed to swear. Rappy's You're very hard. explicit content. Rappy's hey, you know what? I just thought about it. We're gonna actually switch the chat back. Not thinking about it. It's gonna be a and, like, pain in the ass to edit through. <laughs> it's gonna be a pain in the ass, too. That's what you said. That is gonna be a fucking pain in the ass. Rappy, that's what you said. Yeah, you fucking child. I said hard. I did it. <laughs> like, Rappy. Okay. The right, so is back. Shut the fuck up. Didn't even know that what? you left. Yeah, we actually, we actually didn't know you left. <laughs> yeah, Whoa. you pulled it. You pulled the death gun. I kind of like the new chat box the better. Gun. Yeah, honestly, I was thinking about it though. With the right now, just about the actual like editing wise, it's gonna be hell. But uh, with that said though, um, guys, we gotta <laughs> what, watch your language, Cyclone. We we're not allowed to swear. Yeah, Hunter. Yeah. Shit, yeah. sorry. Um. Look, man, ah, YouTube hasn't ah, censored me ah, yet. Damn, I my drink. Look, they haven't censored me yet. Yet. <laughs> I'm waiting on it, but they're not yet. Holy shit, 10 viewers. Hello, everybody. I think that's the most we've had 10 viewers in an actual, like, uh, showing. Hey, awesome. Summer, are you in the house? <laughs> uh, is the D Bob Wifey in the house? Mob Wifey. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> All right. Well, with that said, with that said, um, so we got it. Reason the name of uh, <laughs> the name of this. Uh, wait, what did they actually call this? It better. Was it was the extreme thing? Is that what the actual name? Yeah, the hardcore special. <laughs> hardcore. <laughs> okay. Yeah. Because on my side, it just said E. I was like, oh god, what did they put on here? Yeah. Hardcore e. speeds to PXT is because, uh, ladies and gentlemen, we have a series of hardcore matches to where even tonight's main event box will be defending the hardcore championship against 
Uh, I'm just gonna say a surprise opponent, mainly because uh, I did not expect who got picked in the role. Surprise! Holy okay. fucking shit! Um, Mox, I'm just gonna say this is probably gonna die and probably be dethroned here as our hardcore champion here tonight. And no, but with that no, said, no, no, we don't know. The three of yes. us don't know. I am the it's only like one. Dick. I am the only one in the building that knows who it is. So, <laughs> with that said, God fucking damn, dude. look, man, it's it's gonna be an interesting one. I'm actually really excited right. to see uh, how it plays out. Uh, okay, cool. All right, let's start the show. Anyway, let's come on. Let's let's talk start about something show. else really quick, though. Let's talk about yeah, something gonna... else really quick. No, no spoilers. Okay. You yell at me for that. You yell at me for that. So no spoilers. Anyways, anyways, let's talk about this really quick. We're gonna we're gonna see about um wait cyclone you had an announcement if I remember correctly about the new the new uh the new K twenty. Oh yes, actually talk about but that before anything. Well, you know, well you know what? Talk. You know what? You know what? Let's save that for the call. Let's save that for the call because there's a lot of talk we gotta talk about with when two K twenty four actually drops. We're gonna save that for the call actually. There's so if you guys wanna to hear about that. About and and next next Many week things. will be uh the. So we're just gonna be switching off from just uh, are we doing have a variety. Uh, are we doing community tonight after the show tonight? We no, are doing, doing the call. The call. Yeah, if anything, well, if anything, time. I'll do a shit post off Twitch. So if you guys want to see a shit post, you guys can go to Twitch. Same name. Yeah, if you want to, yeah. Admin, yeah. But it's like, mandatory. It's no, it's not. It's, it's gonna not, be like the four of us, though. It's gonna be the four of us. All right, so real quick, want to talk about what we're starting off with. So these past couple weeks, we've been starting off with G7 and his uh, whole thing with the syndicate so far, where Satoshi yep. has chosen him as his freebie, his gift card match so win. Stop <laughs> breathing, you know? <laughs> <laughs> to where? Uh, God damn it! Breathing to. Hard. To where Satoshi? Oh, okay. God damn it! Ah. <laughs> to where Satoshi has cashed in his shot to go against G7 for the YouTube Championship. Uh, there's yes. been a series of the Syndicate just pretty much destroying G7 and Mason because Mason has also found his uh, way into this whole mix-up because yeah. God damn, the Syndicate has been going crazy. But with that said. Last week, uh, Mason and G7 did go to war against the team of Bill Cassidy and Lawler. They came up short, and before Lawler and Cassidy could do even more damage, they were saved by none other than the White Viper of Russia himself. And uh, when G7, uh, correction, when C. Jill came back, um, and I saw G7 actually, you know, accept the hand and aid of C. Jill. Dude, that spawned a whole goddamn match in my head. So, ladies and gentlemen, for the first time ever here in PXT, yes, we've had, yes, we've had six-man matches in the past, but we've never had an actual six-man tag team match. So, in other words, ladies and gentlemen, we are starting off the night with. A six-man tag team match, and this determines a big thing for Rush. If the Syndicate wins here tonight, they will actually be at ringside for Satoshi for his title match. Also, I just realized, I don't know if it actually did the tag team. Actually, have to reset. Because it just says six-man. It doesn't say six-man tag, so give me one quick set. So in other words, if the Syndicate win here tonight, both... Cassidy and Lawler will be at Satoshi's side. Now, if the Enforcers, that is what uh, we are naming them at this point, if the Enforcers somehow pick up the win, it will be a one-on-one -on -one match with Satoshi and G7 for the PXT YouTube Championship. And the music is playing. Fuck! My one Yeet. flaw, my one flaw is with this match, I feel like the Syndicate will pull it out just because of what Cassidy, and mainly Cassidy alone, gets the wolf back. Real quick guys, we're gonna do a real quick checkup because uh, I had to restart the whole thing. Apparently, actually make the tag team. Drew, it's all your fault. Drew, it's all your fault. Drew did it. Oh, it's God all damn it, Drew. <sighs> it's my... Tag team, anyway. No. <laughs> you know, 
<laughs> it almost got the teams right. <laughs> it almost got the teams right. It fucked up a little bit. Uh, here, I'm gonna put it like this. Right. Right. We do this. Stop it! Yeah. Lot, lot of, um, lot of mishaps. <laughs> a lot of mishaps today. Hey, real quick, put him in there, and then, uh huh. Yep. Nope, nope, nope. Bad shit. Bad. <laughs> I'm like, this will be <laughs> Alright, so real quick, I had to check some stuff, making sure some stuff is actually correct on this, because uh, it's a uh, smooth situation that happened. I shall be back soon. Give me like a good 15, 20, 25 minutes. Bye. Nope. Dave, and now we are with the tag team match. So, as I said, as I said, if the enforcers defeat the syndicate, it will be a one on one match. But if the syndicate come out on top here tonight, it will be D7 practically being by himself. This is uh this is gonna be hell, Jeff. Hell. Tell him so. Should I wish? Can you imagine that'd be pretty cool. You don't wish that upon anybody. PJ, I'm getting my pants you two playing copyrighted music wasn't box. Wait, who's playing copyrighted? Maybe it's already about you. Oh the oh the game yeah because when the game starts it doesn't hit my settings till uh, after I load in. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. Here we go. So here's the thing. Um, G7 has came like G7 excels well in one-on-one -on -one action. With but that I mean, said, though, <laughs> we saw how good he was with tag team action. Now, here's the thing, though. He hasn't picked up a win in tag team action. He's only picked up wins in one on ones. Yeah. But then, not just that. Can you imagine the mental stability of him right now? Because not only does he have to focus on what's ahead of him, but now he has to watch his back. Because the qu the real question is, can he really trust someone like C. Jill? The reason I say that is because, I mean, see, Jill wasn't defeated until G7 got in the ring with him. Does C. Jill hold, like, bad ill will, or is he play fucking with G7, like, mind-fucking him? Like, that's something we gotta look out for, too. We're not sure. I'm not sure about that, but... Uh, you know... Take a, we can take a look at, G, at, uh, at the state of mind of uh, C. Jill. I don't think he's in the play games like That's true. But <laughs> with that said too, I mean, is it show of respect or is it just him probably trying to get a, another shot? I don't know. <laughs> Maybe they're just uniting against a common enemy. Who knows? That's the at strange the thing the too, though. Sorry, go ahead, Demon. Uh, at the end of the day, they are here to do a job as a team. Now, where they coexist after this as a team, we don't know. But no idea. The the, the common enemy, as you were saying, is definitely the syndicate. We all know that C. Jill's had his issues with the syndicate. We all know G. Seven has 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 had some issues with the syndicate. Uh, That's correct one thing I that, wanted right? to point out real quick. Uh, See, Jill actually hasn't had any issues with the syndicate. That's what makes this alliance very questionable. Is that why is well, he throwing his hat in because, here? Because at the end of the day, he knows that Satoshi is a slimy little bastard who's going to weasel his way and screw his way into any match that he can. And we got to remember here, Seagull is a man of honor. 
so. And he thinks that C. Jill is, I mean, not, C. Jill believes that Satoshi is not a very audible man, perhaps. But would that be enough for him to make this type of alliance? Like, that that's the thing I'm questioning right now, gentlemen, is what is C. Jill's motive Maybe C. Jill in this case? Maybe C. Jill is asking him the most common question of anything right now. C. Jill's going to attack them as something. That's my guess. That's what Drew's no. saying. My thought that C. Jill is thinking, what would my father do in this situation? What would he do? And I feel like that's what C. Jill is doing. Maybe. I, I, I was going to say, I can confirm from... Uh, from Back in the day, histories, yeah, he, he would he would fuck them up. <laughs> so, C. Joe's father was an exceptional wrestler. Uh, there's one thing that it separates both him and his father is the mindset that both men had. Maybe C. Jill is turning a corner and he wants to help people. Oh, wait, what's... Wait, what is this? Wait, hold up. Okay, so now I am confused a little. <laughs> so here's the thing, gentlemen. Um... Breaking fourth wall. The Syndicate are an actual team, and I've set them up as a team. For some reason, they're not coming out together anymore. I don't know what's going on. <laughs> like, I, I genuinely don't know why did they're you, not coming out together. Did you change something? For them, no. I changed, like, the movesets, but that shouldn't uh, fuck up their, like, entrances. Damn you, 2K! Who was it? Box! You fucker! There's a reason you're probably gonna die at the end of this fucking thing. Watch. God. You're gonna keep saying that he's gonna win. Watch. I will be amazed, actually, if he picks up a victory. I won't lie to you. you. Know, I, uh, so, so, rumor has it that Bill Cassidy has been talking to his long lost brother here lately. What? Yeah. Wait, what? Well, Cassidy apparently got into, uh, got, uh, with his, uh, got back in contact with his long lost brother. Uh, I would need confirmation on this. Where the hell's the kid? <laughs> Who is he? Not, not the kid, but where the fuck Shane? <laughs> I need confirmation on this. Where is the kid? <laughs> the kid just pops up. Hey, boss, what do you need? No, not you! <laughs> where is the child? <laughs> is Drew booked tonight? Yes, Drew is booked tonight. No, no, fired. Drew is not. Drew got fired. fired. <laughs> God damn it! Nope, Drew's been fired. Now, there's something I gotta ask here, because here's the thing: from what we've been seeing, the Syndicate are a well-oiled team. They are. We gotta give them that. They are a well-oiled team. They work, they synergize so well together because they were able to go toe-to-toe -to -toe with the Unholy and practically destroy the hell Satoshi alone practically destroyed the Unholy before he unveiled the members of the Syndicate. So, that's why it's, it's very hard to see that if these BXC enforcers, if you will, if they can actually pick up a win against a team like the Syndicate. And not just that, so, not just that, Satoshi has not competed since Frostbite, so in other words, he's probably well more rested compared to G7. He's been training, let's, let's, let's he just hasn't been in this, action. Though. We gotta remember, Satoshi has lost matches before. Uh, actually, I think he's he has lost a couple matches, but I think a well, good majority of them was multi-mans. But let's remember, Bill Cassidy is also still suffering some injuries. That's true, but even with that said, he synergizes so well with his next man coming in, Mr. Lawler. The self-proclaimed god of wrestling. Lawler has taken a full 180 in his career, I gotta say, because he went from... Not also, I want to point out Lawler has a lot of shit going in this match right now because he's going against two people that shut him down. One wait, was wait, wait, wait. G7. Where do you see the God of Wrestling? I don't see JBL. I see a man who has 
struggle, but as of here recently, he has improved like himself. But you forget it. He is going across the ring and with the real wrestling god named C. Jill. <laughs> so you let me finish. <laughs> he has a lot of shit going with him mentally <laughs> because I'm bringing that part up. Because C. Jill wasn't even the first one to shut him down. It was actually G7. G7 was the first man to shut his career on a slow step. C. Jill crushed it completely. So Lawler is probably going to be the most fired up in this match if he's inside. Oh my god, the angle. <laughs> All right, right now it looks like G7 is starting off against Bill Cassidy, the syndicate. Not going to be starting up slow at all. Cassidy already got oh shit oh already with a buckle bomb to the corner Cassidy to G7 are we even allowed to do that anymore yes and now it is uh both champion and contender in the ring Satoshi thinking that he can handle himself against the YouTube champion oh and catches him with a big drop kick Oh, but Satoshi, I think, got a little freaked out there <laughs> and immediately tags back in Cassidy. Oh, you could tell by the look on his bald head, he got a little bit right. Oh. Holy fuck, dude. Cassidy again just sends G7 flying. Now, no, like I said, this is the first ever six-man tag team match we've ever had in PXC. We've had, we've had like 3v3s, I mean, but they've never been actual let's, tag teams. Let's be honest here. I'm pretty sure Cassidy has gone cool. against C. Jill before, hasn't he? I don't believe them two have actually ever faced off. That's the crazy thing. C. Jill, as far as I know, has gone against Lawler. And he's gone against former member of the Syndicate, Ace. But he's actually never gone against Cassidy nor Satoshi. So I'd be actually very interested to see how that would play out. I think it's good that they that we're having a three on three here tonight, mainly because C. Jill is a force of nature, as we've seen. Oh uh, yeah, I mean he's only been defeated once here in P. Well, that's a lot. He's he's lost other matches. He's it been was just either. Once. Yes, he has been pinned once in our show. He has lost multi-man matches, but when it comes to one on one or when it comes to him being pinned, only one time. Now, getting back into the match, we have people, two guys who have fought before, Cassidy and, and Dixon. Dixon was able to to show out against Cassidy, but now it seems like Cassidy's ready for it this time, and he's manhandling it. No, oh, yeah, no. no. Yeah, Cassidy is uh, Cassidy's not holding back, oh. and now Satoshi oh. telling him to tag him back in. Oh, and immediately gets him, god damn, with a big running kick. Oh. And right oh, now, Satoshi... Oh, Satoshi playing exactly how he says he sees G7. He's going for the weaker man as he sees. Oh, hey, but he might have he might have made a mistake because Mason catches him for Eric and hits him with a big power bomb. Mm. Oh my god, big power headbutt to the gut. Oh, 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 CGL is in! <laughs> See, Jill is in and immediately goes running straight to Satoshi, but Satoshi, thinking smart, able to get see Jill down. Let's and now comes with big here. strikes. Now, let's be honest here. We can see the brown stain on Satoshi's pants. Little bit of Satoshi no. again, not holding back. He's actually doing exceptionally well against the White that's Viper what, of Russia. That's now, what, that's what Sato if they want to win this match, that's what Satoshi needs to do. He needs to show no fear and go right at. C. Jill. A man like C. Jill, you need to overwhelm him with pressure and offense. Oh, big time. Him down, gets the other two men out, and then says Cassidy in. Man, G, okay. <laughs> G7 was just immune there. <laughs> Who made Mr. Clean? Wait, what? It's the, Who made it's Mr. Clean in the ring? Uh, blessing. Uh, this, my God. The, the, the oh, now see Jill. Now see. Oh my God, a rolling. God damn, oh. that was a rolling bitch smack kid. That was. That's what that was. God damn. You know what though? This is showing that Satoshi. Satoshi knows how to fight though, because hell, he's actually giving his money's worth to see Jill right now. 
Hey Satoshi, Satoshi, real quick, come down here and bend your and bend your uh, head down. I think I got something in my teeth. I need I need to use your giant forehead as a glistening light in a mirror. I oh, no, think. Satoshi going right okay, I gotta say seven. this. I gotta say this though. Oh my God, Mason was able to tag in and immediately Satoshi. Oh, was trying to attack C. Jill oh. on the ropes, but C. Jill coming back at him, and now it is Mason and Satoshi. Man, Sato man, dude, Satoshi fucking solos at this point. What the fuck? <laughs> I feel like we need Lawler to get into well. some action here. You know, Lawler's the only man that has not been in this match at all. Who knows? That might be the strategy remember, from the Syndicate. We gotta remember right now, these men, the Syndicate, they've been together for a while. These guys just kind of threw each other together. That's and what I was saying earlier before really the match started. Here, what they really need to work on here is taking Cassidy out. If they take Cassidy out, their chances of winning go up by fifty percent. I mean, that's the thing. This is a this is a one pinfall. This is this is not a this is not elimination. <laughs> you know, then it, it goes the other way. Then you know what I mean. <laughs> well, I mean, either out, way, Satoshi though. Satoshi. Oh wait! Oh, G Seven catching him in a jumping shock DDT. He immediately goes to the pin on Satoshi, oh, but Lawler there to save. Satoshi oh, from the pinfall. Like I said, he's Cassidy the fresher man fresh. in. Cassidy didn't seem like he was too interested in going in to save it. Because he knew Lawler would get it. And you know, I think Lawler that's that, that, that might be I the mean, plan here. All, I mean, after all, let, let's remember the, where was the syndicate when when Bill Cassidy Ooh. got jumped by the castle. Big brain buster now going for a pin. Satoshi on Mason, but Mason able to kick out. Oh. Disgusting. And then immediately tags in the muscle. <laughs> Cassie's back in, and oh my god! Just tosses Whoa. Mason across the ring. Bye bye. He's and G7 there to like save. Dear god. But Satoshi throwing yeah. G7 outside the ring, and now I believe old Satoshi looking to just distract G7. And now Cassidy hitting the clothesline and going for a pin, but C. Jill was there to save this match this time. C. Jill was there to save the day in that regard. That, that close with Cassidy called... Oh, Ca Cassidy... I can't fucking speak. Oh, Cassidy was going to the top, but C. Jill throws the big man from the top down! Oh, but that does not stop Cassidy at all. My God, just immediately ch fucking trucks Mason after being thrown to the ropes. C. Jill was able to push him over like he was nothing. It's also just, let's also remember it's C Jill. Like Oh. Good reversal. Right now, honestly, I'm gonna be honest with you. I this is pure chaos that's happening right now. And oh, he will sacrifice from Mason to Cassidy, but doesn't go for the pin. It's instead he tags the pin, in Lawler is right there. No, instead he tags in C Jill. Oh, so now it is Cassidy against a fucking giant. Now this is this is what I call a beautiful match the, here. You have two giants. This is the definition of pick on somebody your own size. And right now, C. Jill, C. Jill, C. Jill showing why he is exceptional in the ring. Oh wait, misses that big running knee. Oh, misses. Man, he C. Jill misses two of his biggest moves. Misses the heel kick and misses his big running knee. Oh my god, gets Cassidy up for Father's Blessing! Father's oh, Blessing! God. One! Satoshi oh, able god. to stop the pin! That's what, that's what I mean. He yeah, picked up Cassidy with ease and gets hit with a heel kick! Oh, oh. Wait, 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 oh shit, she Jill's up top! That is the syndicate, is just, they just bounce off each other. She Jill's up top! Oh, oh misses! This is the top rope kick, and now Cassidy is taking advantage of the mishap. Are, are we going to talk about how Lawler punched C. Jill and C. Jill didn't even flinch? He was just it, it, it takes a lot. It takes a lot to take up. All right, can we get, let's get let's get the shit situated, guys. <laughs> it's a lot of talking oh, now over. We got, now we got some tag team action going on. Okay, right now, Lawler finally making his way in the ring, trying to get some payback off of the former YouTube champion. No, see, Jill fucking destroyed any opportunity that Lawler had 
at winning the YouTube Championship. Hell, they had a YouTube Championship match, and CG will destroy Lawler with that very move. The Father's Blessing again goes with a pin, but Satoshi was there Satoshi to stop. Satoshi was there to save it. Pretty much, yeah. Now, Hunter, I understand what you're saying there with... I'm going to agree with you there. Lawler got fucking squashed like a fucking bug beneath Sigil's shoe. But now you know, before, Lawler has, re has been reborn. Uh, I would not say reborn, but he, he's there. <laughs> G7 catching Lawler with a big okay. top rope elbow. No, I would say that Lawler has, uh, has found the right people to help him in his career and i think it's helping him tremendously honestly i think it's reinvigorated the guy because oh as you can big see, time he's he's done a lot more in his career than he's done as of recent all right now oh my god that ripcord clothesline has i believe probably knocked out g7 satoshi in the ring probably looking to make a statement here tonight And also, no, breaking fourth wall. I don't know how long this match is going to be. <laughs> oh, no, it's going to be a long one. Yeah, this is going to be a long-ass match. So, uh, people, <laughs> uh, buckle your seatbelts. All I'm going to say is that you should have made it elimination. <laughs> what, if it, what if it helped? Oh, wait, Satoshi looking to make G7 tap out here tonight. Yeah, well, I think really if it was, really I think, I think if it was, uh, if it was a free-for-all, yeah, but it, not if it's uh what's it called oh and g yeah. seven game caught into that mist from satoshi into a punt is that enough <coughs> one no mason there to save <coughs> the match oh but mason throws lawler out of the ring oh but satoshi catching him while his back is turned and now satoshi looking to take out all the all support that G7 has, and now it is just G7, Satoshi, and Cassidy. Oh, this ain't good. This is not good. G7 is, not is in there good. alone, it's and Satoshi going for the pin, no. thinking that might be enough to put G7 no. down. No! Nope. nope. Of course not, because it's G7. It's G7. Come on. G7 kicks Champion. out. I was about to say that might have been the scene we were probably going to see at PXT Rush. <laughs> Oh, Cassidy was trying to truck G7, but G7's not having it. My God, big strikes to the Giant from the Syndicate. And right now, G7 in control of this match. Yes, the curse is going to oh, happen here. Just knocks, just knocks Cassidy flat on his ass. Oh, catches him into a tornado shock. DDT, is that enough? No, we actually will not know because Lawler was there to save it. Lawler was in there quick. That's what I'm saying. Lawler's the quickest man on his feet in this match. Look, see, Jill took his time getting to the ring. Mason's out on the floor. G7 with the pin. Oh, and again, it is two, again, it's two giants. Lawler. Again, it's two giants. Wait! Oh. Oh, CJ was about to get caught in terrible situation there, but was able to get out of the big power bomb. Oh, but catches Cassidy with the heel kick and now looks to possibly lift up the giant once more, but this time for Father Sins. Father ah. Sins. Meanly goes for the pin, but again, Lawler uh, quick on his feet there. <laughs> to save the match. And see Jill immediately takes out Satoshi. I think C. Jill knows what he needs to do and he just needs to do it. Satoshi no, is so selfish. They know Satoshi <laughs> won't break up a pin if he needs to. What they need to do, wear down Cassidy, get Lawler out of the equation, go for the pin. Oh, well, right when you said that Cassidy now hits the big discus on C. Jill, but Talk G7 there everything. to save Almost. the win. Almost Take takes me. the head off of C. Jill. And yeah, no, right now, Cassidy is actually holding down the White Viper of Russia right now. We've seen, but we've seen CJ in these types of situations before. I and think that this, that this should be deterred, deterring him. Well, now it's tag team action off of CJ attacking the arm. Oh, and now CJ getting caught into the mist with Satoshi into a punt. And now Satoshi looking to pin the White there Viper, but G7. Satoshi. There to save it. The mist was so, like the ref was in clear. Oh, it's the old one. That's why. Yeah, this, yeah, this, yeah, this, yeah, this ref sucks. <laughs> Let's be honest here. 
We, we I've tried. He doesn't <laughs> leave. A heel kick from CG to Satoshi. One, Ooh, two. One. No! no! Lawler was actually late! I think Lawler thought Satoshi was gonna kick out! <laughs> if, if Satoshi was not so awake man. there, let me say this, Satoshi was not awake there, that would have been the win. And CJ missing. I think Satoshi was talking shit and now immediately tags in Lawler was saying, where the fuck were you there? <laughs> Oh Please. wait, Godly Law off of C Jail and immediately oh G7! My God. One of the most wait. beautiful moves. Wait, what the fuck? Wait, what was wait, whoa, whoa, whoa. What did G7 do? G7 came in immediately but didn't break out the pin. Mason had to come in to save the match. What the hell was I don't know what by the looks of it. I don't know I don't what G7 was thinking. Really trying to work together. I don't think the enforcers, as we call them, aren't trying to work together. I don't know about saying that there. so I don't know about saying that so soon. I just don't know what G7 was thinking right there. But now, right when I say that, both former both former and current YouTube champions coming in to teamwork. And now G7 catching Lawler with King Slayer. One, King Slayer. One, two, two, no. 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 I want to point out nobody from the syndicate went out to help. I believe I believe Satoshi Cassidy came in, but Satoshi that's, seemed a little bit scared. That's, no, no, I'm going to tell you what happened there. I believe Satoshi had told Cassidy to not do it. I don't think Satoshi is taking the actual stipulation well enough, because think about it. He can handle his own one-on-one -on -one action. He's just seeing the members as insurance. And now we got, we, got, All right. we got Dixon and Cassidy on the outside having a fight. Yeah, right now, right now, right now is pure chaos. The only one that's not in this chaos is Satoshi and G7. Now Lawler again turning his attention to C. Jill. Looks like C. C. Jill looked like he was coming to help out Mason. Yeah, I know that's exactly what was happening. Shinbreaker. Want to point out we are at count of six. If this is how it ends, and this is I will not take it. I will fucking take it. <laughs> I will fucking take it. I mean, if this is how it ends, what's that going to mean for the stipulation? What is it? Uh, yeah, what it's it's whoever's in. It's it's whoever wins. <laughs> what if it's a draw? Oh, if it's a draw, uh... That means we both flip, teams get to be We inside, flip a coin. Yeah, we flip the coin. Uh -oh. Thank you, d -Man. Right now, G7. This manhandling Lawler and immediately goes for the pin, but this time Cassidy now able to go out oh, and wait. save his... Member, oh wait, I think G7 yeah. was trying to go for King Slayer. Doesn't connect with it. He just needs a few more goblin oh. laws just to finish him out. Right now, G7 tagging in Mason. That is another, oh, this is a rematch here. Oh yeah, between Lawler and Mason, uh huh, hundred percent. Honestly, the thing I gotta say real quick is that on our past episode of MTW, uh, Mason actually achieved his first pinfall against a uh, franchise. Believe it or not, wasn't able to pick up the wins because it was a mountaintop match, but that was his first not pinfall so far. And yeah. Oh, but catches Satoshi with the hero spearhead, oh. Oh, but doesn't get the pins. Cassidy was there to save the big boss, if you will. Maybe they're giving Lawler a break and having Cassidy do it when they need to do it. Since Lawler's been... I think Lawler looks tired and from the beating he took from G7. He just needs to... No, I, be no, I believe there bit. there's tension right now with the Syndicate. I don't think there's tiredness. There's tension like right there's now. there's tension right yeah. Because ever since now, he was late on that, Satoshi is not... The, ever since that late save, <laughs> Satoshi that, that is now a, not looking at a Lawler that was completely a good. Float over DDT by Mason on the big man. It was right now, Mason able to take keep control. Uh, it's because Cassidy has gotten a little bit hurt now. So oh, Cassidy! Cassidy's practically fucked. Let's be honest here. He's gotten caught not in just the father's blessing. He got caught in the father's sins, but now catches. G7, oh, oh, what the fuck was that? That was a new one. He calls it the Texas Rack DDT, or Rack the Shotgun, if you will. I don't know. Oh, but Mason there to break up the Texas Rack. We're just gonna call it the Peace Shooter. 
It's hard to understand with that thick Texan accent he has. And hits a timber off of G7. Oh, goes with a pin, but to C Timber. C Jill was there to save it though. This time. Oh, Ava catches him in a shock! Jumping shock, DDT, and CJ and Satoshi are now fighting on the outside. Lawler looking to help oh, Satoshi. Lord. But I want to point out, in the ring! In the ring! King's fall off of Cassidy! One! Oh, no. Two! Oh, two! No! Cassidy oh. kicks out this time! That was the perfect victory for the enforcers here. Well, that Cassidy might have been Cassidy's. That might have been Cassidy's last breath right there. Maybe, maybe not. We don't know. Mason's up. Satoshi watching. Want to point out, Satoshi is watching C. Jill, making sure he's not getting up. Smart man. Very smart man. Yeah, because right now it is Cassidy and Lawler in the ring. These two men are going at it, mind you. Well, now, it, now again, it is a rematch between G7 and Lawler. Again, Lawler got to be feeling not just the pressure, but feeling high emotions for getting vengeance on both G7 and C. Jill, but misses the big Heidi. Yes, I know what I said. I know what I said. My question he is. Said, oh, wait. Godly Law on the G7. Here it is for the win. Mason, though, there to save the match. What were you saying, my dear sir? <laughs> but now, let's think about it like this. What is this going to do to G7 if he can beat them in tag team action? Let's, let's remember this. He's only able to stay in as long as he is because he has help. Oh, I mean, that goes same thing with everybody that has been hit with a big move. But right now, G7 catching Satoshi into a barricade. Bakum bomb? I really don't know. It was a power bomb. Straight into the barricade. A barricade oh, power a bomb. barricade bomb. He just is probably looking for the ring out just so he can get the oh. syndicate off his oh, back. Oh, actually, I want to point out Lawler is the legal man, and Mason is actually holding Mason's Lawler down. Mason's playing it smart, giving G7 a maybe an easy win here. Possibly, Mason I mean. Took it, took it right well, no. To Lawler. Lawler is back in, but I want to point out it's only Lawler in the syndicate. But catches G7 with. Oh no! Gets reversed! Oh, immediately gets pinned. Oh, here it is. One! Right two! Here. No! Two. Only gets a two. Satoshi no. was able to get in and save Lawler. Satoshi was able to get in in time. Satoshi finally noticing that his team, his faction, needs help. No, uh, he doesn't he's see him as a team, and he doesn't see him as a faction. He sees them as he's pawns. Them Let's be honest here. Policy. Pretty much, that's that's the whole reason for this match. He believes no, he can beat G7. Here. Cassidy is his biggest insurance policy. Oh, hundred percent. At ringside, it might be over for him. Well, oh wait, oh. Cassidy I don't know what. The unholy. By himself, mind you. Oh, wait, wait. OG7 going for a roll up. Off of Lawler. One, two. One, two. No. No. Damn, that probably was probably going to be the closest thing to a roll up we'll ever see in PXT. <laughs> like a roll up victory. He's trying to play it cheap there, just trying to get this match over with, and just so he can get a fair fight with Satoshi. And now, G7 was going for the big chest shots, too. Cassidy and now G7 is busted open, but now comes in fighting. But Satoshi with a cheap shot doesn't stop G7's offense, though. G7 is a madman. What is it with these horrible human beings and shots to the back of the head? I don't know, but G7 immediately tagging in the White Viper. I say we get Mason. They can get Mason in there. Mason has had the least amount of punishment dealt to him, and he's done a lot of damage to Lawler outside the ring. Well, why would you he say that? Mason that. actually comes in to save C. Jill from a pin. But here's the thing, Mason. With that said, Mason has only seen little success with one on ones, and that was an MTW PXT. He has struggled to kick off, especially against the Syndicate. Because even last week, I mean, if I'm correct, Mason was the one that got pinned. Mason did get pinned. So I think that's probably why Mason is wanting to rely a little bit more on G7 and C. Jill. And C. Jill getting Lawler up for another father's blessing. But Satoshi probably going to 
Yeah, Soji gets there for the save. The tag team matches, aren't they fun, guys? <laughs> <laughs> I feel like at a point Satoshi's just gonna get tired of this and just have the, one of the men get pinned just so he can just fight G7 at Rush. I can confirm, Drew, that that is false on your record. <laughs> one, two, okay, Lawler was trying to get a pin. I'll see Jill, only gets a one. Mason was there to save it. I'll give you that, yeah. But PXC record still doesn't, still doesn't look that great. <laughs> yeah, definitely not. Oh my God. Big brain buster. Oh, oh! Sweeps CJ's legs and actually it was enough force to pop him open and immediately goes for the pin and... Oh! Wait, what's this? Oh, that's just a shock DDT off of Lawler! But Satoshi was already ready to save Lawler for the pin. I think he already knew that was going to be it. You can that say was that beautiful. was shocking. That was a beautiful double underhook DDT. Very uh, sir, now that, that was a shock, DD. What are you? Want? A shock, DDT. <laughs> Shocking. Oh my God, big belly to belly from G7, and now Lawler looking to tag in. It tags in the number one contender for. Oh, what the fuck? <laughs> Satoshi, I don't know what Satoshi was doing there. Misses the mist, and now it is contender against champion in the ring. A preview. Maybe get the speed. Oh wait! Oh wait! Oh, oh what the? We got Kokita Clutch from G7 to Satoshi, but Satoshi oh. is... Well, Satoshi knows his way in and out of submission holds. Oh, he's going for a bulldog. Misses it. Oh, gets caught on a rolling neck breaker right now. G7 up and at it. And catches it with a jumping shot, DDT, and bust open the crime boss. God. Cassidy's on the ropes here. Oh, Mason. Mason's tagged in. Mason's tagged in. I don't know what's going on here. I'm not sure. It goes in for a big gut shot. Okay, I thought we were going to see something big from Mason. But I, I guess not. Oh, wait. No, I was wrong. Ladies and gentlemen, this is going to be some heroes. The most well, I wouldn't say electrifying, because if it was electrifying, it would hit. <laughs> <laughs> oh, and gets caught into the mist, into the punt, straight to that face of Mason. Goes for the pin. Man, both syndicate members are ready on that time. Holy shit. They did that in unison. They did that in unison. I think uh, I think think the boss's message finally came in clear. Oh, Mason was trying to go for something. The mist can burn someone's eyes. <laughs> what do you mean? Wait, you liked him at one point? <laughs> I don't like him. I ish. When he was with Ace, when he was with Ace, because Ace is cool. Yeah, oh, honestly, was... Ace was Ace was a liability at this point. Let's be honest here. Oh wait! He have the advantage of the oh, unholy. Cassie oh, catches Mason with a peacekeeper, but Mason oh. immediately back up. Dear God, or just the willpower. Jesus, the willpower of this man is. Oh wait! Incredible. Oh, catches him into a oh, big gosh. punch in the corner and hits the hero spearhead oh, off of Cassidy. Oh. One no. One. That was Doesn't. that was something we've never seen. Before. Oh, yeah. catches Satoshi with the running hero spearhead. <laughs> Dear God, no, Mother not. just cleaned house. Holy shit! What about Lola? I, I gotta point something out here though. Uh, Satoshi's not the legal man, <laughs> but it looks like they're now they're now double teaming off of Satoshi here. They're double teaming the wrong man. Oh, but He's Cassidy, the legal man. Cassidy coming in to punish oh, I Mason. I thought, we see, I thought we were about to see something that we've seen before from a certain. Oh. Uh, from a certain uh, intercontinental champion. Oh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, G wait, G7 tagged in? 
Yeah, okay. I got a C-17 dead! I can't fucking see it! <laughs> G7 tagged in against the little pin off of Cassidy! The PXC enforcers pick up the win! The fun, I, 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 would, I would like to, I would like to say here, but I would like to say here that I think that Cassidy thought that Mason was still tagged in. Honestly, yeah, I, that's what I thought! I completely shoulders. <laughs> <laughs> Holy shit! I I actually forgot about that. <laughs> I won't lie. <laughs> wow. Looks like the PXT enforcers have picked up the win here tonight after a hard-fought battle. Yes, sir. Oh, 100 percent. But with that said, too, that means now between G7 and Satoshi, it is a one-on-one, one-on-one -on -one match for the YouTube Championship at Rush, which is, by the way. Rush is going to be happening on January 31st. That's right, we barely meet our deadline for this fucking big show. <laughs> Barely, but we made it. So that is when PXT Rush is going to be. Uh, honestly, I think that's going to be a big fucking show, mainly because uh, we're going to have we're going to have a lot of debuts. We're going to have a lot of uh, NTW stores also come making their way in as well. But with that said, now it is time to squash uh, some beef that's been going on for the past couple weeks. Um, so uh, recently. Uh, Drew has been seeing a lot of success, and I want to say it started off when he went toe to toe with Johnny Tagalua. Um, he was able to pick up a surprising win to where we didn't even expect Drew to pick up the win. I'll be honest here. Um, now, with that said, can he do it again here tonight? Because tonight it is going to be Drew Jeffrey going one on one once more against Johnny Tagalua. Guys, that, 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 hey, 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 come on. Finally I figure out how to uh, say his breaking last the wall name. here, Cyclone. Hmm. Do, do y'all hear the noise of Cyclone's mic, or Megan? Not. Or is that just the live stream doing that? I was gonna say, I, I just hear noise on your end. Me? <laughs> uh, oh, oh, yeah, I just, uh, no, yeah, I just, me? yeah, I just hear noise on your end. That's it. Okay, that's give me a boss. second. And I'll it's, try it's to, uh, is, is it my TV? Maybe? I don't know. Yeah, I haven't even been in the door. It doesn't happen anymore. Oh, dude, y'all should have said something. I'll fix it right now. Give me one second. Honestly, I don't know how long it was going. All I know is going when I was, like, saying this next match. <laughs> yeah, that's, that's my fault, y'all. I'm sorry. Alright, uh, y'all good. By the way, Drew Jeffrey coming back. Uh, we... He, uh... That, a soul was so bad that he we had to give him a week off. Where now he wants to pay back and he wants to take out Johnny once and for all. And who knows? Maybe he can do it. Cause let's be for real here. Drew has uh, Drew's been popping off a little bit. But we can't take really? anything away from Johnny. Uh, fifty fifty on Johnny right now. Fifty fifty. Well, Reason I, I say that. I'm, I'm basically going off the match he had with Zach and the stuff he pulled out of his ass. <laughs> That's true, but with that said, Johnny technically has only gone against, well, multiple opponents, but also technically just Zach and Drew when it comes to one-on-one -on -one action. We haven't seen him go against the likes of more people. I'm so curious why he, uh, wets the hoodie, the hood of his hoodie. Is that better, y'all? Tiny bit. <laughs> okay, cool, cool. I'm so sorry about that, y'all. Y'all should have said something. Hi, Why do you do that, John? Why he loves wetting his head, man. It hypes him up. <laughs> wetting his head. head, head. God damn it. God damn it. God damn it, Shane. Oh, you please, John, Shane is now suspended for five years. Don't tell me. <laughs> oh, man. All right, but no, John, honestly, uh, this is this is actually a perfect time to see the match that happened at the beginning of this month was actually a fluke or not between Johnny and Drew. From what I've heard, Johnny's been saying that it was a fluke. Who's the MTW champion? No, MTW US champion. Oh. Okay. Yeah. I was like, wait, what? <laughs> <laughs> but no, Johnny's been saying that that match with Drew was a fluke. I mean, well, we're he's gonna, about to show it here tonight. Tonight, if it was. Yeah. 
What do you think, Luna? What are, what are your thoughts? You know what I think? I think Johnny is a good Weber. competitor. Sorry. He just needs to find his footing, you know, uh, such as other stars, you know, like uh, such as D Mob or, you know, Michael Wolf. Michael Wolf still hasn't found the right footing he needs. I feel like D Mob is found his footing. But D Mob most certainly has. And another Oof. person like Dixon. Dixon's slowly finding his footing. Actually, I just realized, I believe uh, tonight is actually Mason's first win in PXC really? technicality. Oh, congratulations, Mason. <laughs> I just realized that. But right now, uh, starting off the action, Drew taking control against Johnny. Flip, monkey, flip. This this monkey. is what I was monkey. talking about to where Drew has been popping off. I'll, I'll be honest with you, man. Seeing Drew start off with the monkey, it's, it's a great, it's a great thing. It it, that, that monkey, monkey. monkey. Oh, wow. Oh, my God. Big strike hits from, oh, Johnny straight to Drew. This is, oh, oh. Looks like, looks like Johnny's trying to prove that it was a fluke. Oh, that, and also showing his. He is. Just so the that, point where you can throw one foot over your head and kick you in the face with the other. Holy shit, a running crossbody. No, but that's what I was going to say. He was showing his striking capabilities there. Oh my god, big fucking drop kick from Drew. Oh. Drew's not playing around, though. He is not playing around. Oh, well, he's really not. He's well, well, what do you expect from the daddy of PXT? You're mm. welcome, Drew. Uh, I, I respectfully disagree with that claim. I protest it's Electro. I can confirm that uh, Electro will not be called Daddy of PXC. He is the Triple Crown of PXC. <laughs> I, I can confirm it is C. Jill. Yes. C. is not the Daddy. He is the White Viper. And look at this, Drew going in for a quick victory here. A roll up off of Johnny doesn't connect with it though, or doesn't uh, fully get the win off of it. Doesn't fully get it, but you know he's gonna try to do it again. Oh, for sure. But I'll, I gotta say this. Johnny's actually really showing what he's made of here tonight now. Oh, he is God's praise. Oh. Oh, is that what that was? <laughs> oh, wait, that was a, that was a sig? <laughs> yeah. I'm not gonna lie to you. I thought that was just one of his grapple moves. <laughs> no. <laughs> no. Oh, and Bug gets caught in a sexy kick. Is it enough to put Johnny out? Oh, God. No. We've seen that sexy kick take out so many people. About to be former PXD champ. Hey, we gotta wait. But with that hey, said too, um, that, with Back. that said too, with that said too, uh, to make sure no excuses are said from both Smooth and Electro, we have given both men a week off to recuperate. All I'm gonna say is, Smooth, if you lose, pay up. <laughs> <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? You better pay the piper, motherfucker. <laughs> God damn it. You're gonna pay me, Rocky, and D-Mob all 50 bucks. Oh my fucking God. Did you guys actually did We are not doing you bets do? for this shit. That's my no. Venmo. I'll give this you my Venmo over do, this one. This we, is what are not, we are not doing bets. No. No gambling. <laughs> Yeah. Fucking, me, no my, fucking my gambling. Getting, God damn Sorry. it! Fuck you. <laughs> we're gonna we're gonna talk we're gonna talk about the uh, 2K24 on the call after the show. This that's up there because uh, because we, yes, yes. we do we do gotta talk about some stuff with it. Yeah. 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 But back to the action what? Of this match. Dummy. Yeah. Yeah. Anyway, yeah, no. uh, Drew Drew has been taking a little bit more control of it. Johnny now finally coming back at it. Oh, the big headbutt on the apron. Oh, wait, Johnny going for a suicide dive off of but, Drew Jeffrey. But going with what I said earlier, do, do you feel like that Johnny has necessarily gotten his footing here in PXT? Cyclone. Yeah, I, I, like I wouldn't good. say no. Honestly, I'm gonna say he's still he's still green. In other words, he hasn't found his footing just yet. He made an exceptionally, exceptionary like exceptionally. Yeah, I don't, I, that, look, I I know I know I fucked up my words. Fuck off. Uh, but no, he made an explosive <laughs> debut. With that said, though, we now have high standards when we see him in the ring. But we got to remember, this is still his first wrestling promotion. But not his so, first fighting 
promotion. Uh, still, wrestling is different compared to UFC and every other sport. Same thing with that with UFC and boxing. So, with that mm -hmm. said, it's a different, yeah. it's a different world. No. Yeah. So for Johnny, Johnny going, I think Johnny going in for the yeah kicks. So with that said, Johnny's going to need a lot more time to find his full footing, not just in PXC, but just in this sport in general. You know what, though? Y'all just, uh, you know, don't think it's smooth to pull it off. Oh, don't I don't think right smooth now. pulls it off. I'll, I'll be honest right with you. I'm not dissing. That's one thing. You I feel no like Ladies, can we get back to the action, please? Can we get back to the action, please? Oh, and Listen, again, All catches Johnny with another know, sexy kick, but his foot was level. underneath the rope. So Johnny doesn't it smart. Yeah. He might be a <laughs> I wouldn't even say it was smart. I'm going to be honest with you. I think it was just the long legs of Johnny saving him. He's not even that tall. <laughs> For him. <laughs> You know, it, it did save big. him though, because yeah, honestly, that might have been uh, that might have been it if his feet weren't there. Shay and Rocky are haters. <laughs> no, <laughs> look, I'm gonna sure. be honest with you. I'm going sure. for smooth against Electro, and hell, breaking fourth wall here. Yes, I understand. I'm voicing the fucker. I'm still going for smooth. I want an original to hold these titles. I want originals to hold all the titles. I don't like my guys being dominant. Okay. <laughs> Speak for yourself. Choke. <laughs> I am speaking for myself in this case. <laughs> he technically is. Yeah. All right, back to the action. Back in the character, Rocky. I just want to say that was a crown that Jimmy King would have been proud of from Drew Jeffries. Oh yeah. Oh, you bet. All right now, like I said, Drew has had full control of this match so far to where Johnny, I mean, he gets big shots in, but it's not <laughs> enough to, like, keep Drew down. Bless you. Oh, Johnny's going to need a lot more <laughs> God, than these small you. bursts of fire that he's <sighs> given out. Oh, big time. Oh, wait. Oh, going for... Oh, what the fuck? Oh, shit. Powerbomb oh. into a Samoan drop. This oh. beautiful athleticism and power and strength all in one. But, I mean, his cockiness is showing here, because immediately... Oh, wait. Oh! Okay, well, I was going to say his cockiness might have costed him, but surprisingly it did not. Oh, my God. It, comes in with... Right now comes in with... Butts. Well, now coming in with big headshots, and now bust open Drew Jeffrey. My God. That ain't Man, a sexy face open. anymore. Busts open the face of Jeffrey. Oh, wait. The true Samoan spike! Oh. Is that enough? One, two, Most likely no. Not. Drew Jeffrey kicks out, surprisingly. Because after after Johnny busts you up, you know it's going to be a quick match after that. Oh, yeah. Oh, hey, but Drew, looking to set up. Well, maybe one final. Oh, sexy kick right there. Is that sexy. enough? One, two, no. Johnny kicks out. Oh, but the one thing we have to realize here, Drew busted up the Samoan. Oh, that's true. He, usually when that happens, uh, well, Johnny does do get more. That. He did do that in the last match, and it didn't prove truthful for Johnny at all. That is a fair point. Hey, right, here it is. So, what? Oh, big dude, suicide. Go, well, big outside dive. Right, uh, like, going off subject. I found out oh. something about wrestling that I never knew the other night. Huh. Did you know? Rock, baby, sister. Uh, you that do I'm not, Batman. Uh, when you headbutt a Samoan, they don't sell it. No Samoan oh. in wrestling history has ever sold a headbutt. I can see it. Supposed to. But yeah, because like uh, Samoans are naturally supposed to have like harder heads. Or something like that. That's what oh, they shit. explained. Oh, beautiful bridge. Yeah. And the bridge was enough to pin Johnny Tagaloa. Okay. And Drew picks up the win. Anyways, guys, those are your wrestling facts for today. Just I don't even uh, I didn't even hear what it was. <laughs> uh, so, so Mullins, oh, are supposed to just naturally oh, have no, harder no. heads. They have hard heads. Basically. All right. Yeah, yeah, much, so, yeah. so, with that said, Wait, what the hell? Wait, Drew's getting the mic.
And Drew has just named his claim into the PXT rush. No, you can't say undefeated because you have been defeated. Um, <laughs> uh, has made his claim into the PXT rush match, but he has heard uh, some talk that we were actually going to talk about, and he is naming his claim into that match as well. So, uh, ladies and gentlemen, um, I guess now it's time to talk about it. We are going to be having... A match that has happened this year, Hunter. Nope, doesn't count. <laughs> has to count for the entire promotion, not this year. So, counting with that, or coming off of that, we've had this match happen in MTW. We are going to be having that at PXT Rush, which is the Bond match at PXT Rush, which is four teams of two. Pulse count anywhere. <laughs> Weapons are allowed. Elimination match to where there is a chance a sole survivor could pick up the win for the next double one contendership shot for the PXT Tag Team Championships. Ooh. And Drew apparently says he is naming his claim into that match. Now the question is, who the fuck is his partner? Oh. I guess we're gonna, have to, oh, we're gonna have to wait and see at PXT Rush. Well, so I, ho I hope ah. he's the sexy he's as the daddy of PXT. No, um, so, uh, break, break, breaking, break, no, I didn't fart. That was me, uh, I like what I did with last week. Um, so, uh, <laughs> God damn it. So real quick, where's Pond uh, Pina, Hunter? Hunter, where's Pond Pina? Out for the week. Okay. Yeah. Um, not a PXT show. Yeah. Huh? So with that said, um, again breaking fourth wall here. Remember what happened last week? Rising. Oh God. Something similar just happened tonight, but this one's actually a way better, and it honestly is probably one of my dream matches. With the women's division, because tonight Ooh. apparently Amy Moreno was hell impressed with uh, Caitlyn's athleticism. To where now tonight, ladies and gentlemen, it is Ava Moreno going one on one with Caitlyn. Ooh. Here we oh. go. Oh, Spoon's wife. Yeah, great match right here. Oh, this is gonna be interesting. <laughs> That's what I'm saying. This is actually one of my dream matches because I was curious to see who the fuck would win this. D Mob, I, I, I think that we're just gonna have to hide D Mob for uh, Ava what? real quick. Get under the table, D Mob. Just, just get under the damn table. Yeah, this, this, that. We need to. What? He's already seen it. Hey, Slade, ain't that your jacket? <laughs> hers, it's hers now. Uh, uh, no. <laughs> when, I, when I go over that story. <laughs> when I go over that story. I will not read what's in chat. I will not read what's in chat. Yeah, you got the t-shirt off, buddy. Oh, shit. Yeah. Have you, have you talked to her about the jacket? Have you talked to her, like, at all about it, Slade? By any chance? Every time I see that in the same that Slade looks fucking out of it. Hey, 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 that's not true. That's what she said. That's what she said to the DMOB. I did not. Oh fuck! I didn't do it. It was not possible. Slate, I'm just gonna say this. So, gentlemen, gentlemen, back on point here. We got to I'm actually excited to see this match because here's the thing. Caitlyn made a fucking made a fucking impact of a goddamn debut against Ember Jeffrey. But I mean, let's be honest here. Sadly, oh sad to say it, but Emma Jeffrey's not that much of a fighting competitor. Ooh. Ooh. I know we all feel bad. <sighs> especially but, let's, but let's but let's remember this. But um, she went up against yeah. a real We don't talk and about we do not angry woman. Okay, let him finish, guys. <laughs> known as Alexia. Alexia stomped her lights out. Alright, well that's that too, Alexia got like fucked up. Oh, I just want to point that out real quick. <laughs> I, I, I just want to point out real quick. We do not talk about Emma Jeffrey's replacement. We don't. Replacement, we, what? We, 
Oh, oh, that case. No, we're yeah, that, yeah, that, 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 <laughs> We are not talking about it at all. Do not read what he said. <laughs> oh, yeah, no, Dan, we're not reading that. <laughs> I have some, I have some stuff I will fucking uh, I have some stuff I will censor for the show. Okay, <laughs> that that right there might be one. Alright, but here it is. PXD Women's Champion going against <laughs> Former UFC women's champ, I want to point out, Caitlyn. So th this is actually oh, very shit. interesting. This might, this might be bad for, for this crazy woman in Ava Moreno. Because let, let's be honest here. This woman is just a showman. <laughs> Honestly, maybe, but at the same time, I mean, Caitlyn, uh, hey, she did make her debut. Well, not debut. She did make her... Uh, well, yeah, I guess debut in MTW win the women's tournament. She didn't pick up the win, but... But she went toe to toe though. <laughs> oh shit! She Big did. spear from Kaylin to Ava. It only gets a one count though. I know, goddamn. Looked like it broke her in half. <laughs> no, but as I said though, Kaylin has made like her name a fucking like staple at this point in the women's division. She has. <laughs> She's only had two matches. Staple. She's showing what the women's division can be here. Oh my god. And catches. I didn't even think that connected against Ava, but apparently it was enough to send Ava to the outside. And now Caitlyn going. Uh, I don't know what happened there, but uh, yeah, it happened. Huh? I, I have no idea what happened there. I'm just going to leave it like that. <laughs> right now, Kaylin... Uh, oh, it looks like Kaylin's a big fan of uh, G7. Uh, what now? Oh, oh, oh. Uh -huh. oh the DDT. <laughs> that was a... It was a shock DDT, I swear. No, I'm joking. It was a shock oh, DDT. Boy. Excuse me. I want to point out, we are at a count of five. Oh, Ava getting out of harm's way of a dangerous suplex and sends Caitlyn, oh, body first into the announce table. This might be bad for our Get this bitch away from me. Wait, 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 what is she going for here? Wait, what? Going for a series of suplexes. Wait a minute, isn't... No, d this time you're being... Oh, and is this how Ava's going to take the win? Oh, oh my god, no. she almost took <laughs> bring out count, but she went in for a dive. Literally last fucking second. <laughs> it was crazy, but she's not stupid. I'll give you that. Then immediately goes for a pin off Caitlyn. Doesn't get it. Wasn't that right now, my, my god, big forearm. Right now, Ava's. Oh, this is the small kick to the shin right there to Kaylin. And now Kaylin coming in with big knee shots and a spin kick to the gut. Mm -hmm. Misses another kick to Ava. Now Ava's coming in with a series of her own punches. Oh my god, big fucking uppercut right there. One thing I will say is that Ava is not afraid of people. Okay, breaking fourth wall real quick. I just realized something. Uh, that whole that whole tag team match. Um, I wasn't moving the controller, and I don't know how the match did not fucking cut out. <laughs> what, what? I, did, I swear I didn't move it at all, and somehow it didn't cut out. <laughs> hmm. So uh, phenomenal. <laughs> I just realized that now because I'm doing it right now. <laughs> All right, back to the match, and it looks like Ava's going for Slade's love right there off of Caitlyn. Is that enough? She's not going for the pin, though. I think she knows that she needs more. Oh, no. She's she's looking for... She's looking to make her tap out here, but Caitlyn immediately gets out of it. Ooh, almost immediate. Let's, let's remember, Caitlyn is not new to submission maneuvers. Oh my god, another big spear to the gut of Ava. Not enough to keep her down, and now, big suplex! Oh! Yeah, no, that's what I was about to say, too. 
Kaylin is not unfamiliar when it comes to submission holds at all. Hell, she was able to tap out uh, Emma Jeffrey on her debut. I don't know if we're going to see that here tonight. I don't know. She's going to need a little bit more than that to put away somebody as crazy as, as Ava here. Yeah, no, I, I can agree on that. I got a big gut shot right now. I got to get props, though. This match is holding up extremely well to what Honestly, I thought it was going to be. this match is exactly what I thought it was going to be. <laughs> yeah, I'm glad it's a good back and forth, and I fucking love it. Honestly, <laughs> I thought, at the first few minutes, I thought Ava was going to get fucking bodied, and I'm like, well, shit. There goes that. Yeah, no. Yeah, no. This is the actual fight. And look at that. Kaylin thinking smart, knowing the rules of the match, immediately goes to the rope to save herself from possibly a pinfall. Yep. I don't know. Almost a possible pinfall. Ton. And right now, Ava on the top rope. Goes for a big splash off of Kaylin into a pin. One, One two. two. No, only gets no. a two count. That was a good splash. splash. Actually, was <laughs> I'm telling you, man. Ava fucking she fucking Everyone floats splash. sometimes. And now again, goes, do we ever find a name for this move? By the way, oh, and makes the former UFC Women's Champion tap out here tonight. Another another wow. accolade on the belt of Ava Moreno. Damn. Honestly, I I did not expect the tap out. Oh wait, wait, wait. It's not a bird, it's not a blade, but a super girl, Sammy Ken, attacking Ava Moreno. Oh, my oh wait, goodness. she holds the women's championship. Oh, sizing hey, hey, Ava up hey, and hits her straight to the hey, face hey, hey, with the women's championship. Oh, God. Hey, hey, that's not, that's not right. Supergirl Sammy Ken. <laughs> Sorry, I thought we'd never see from her. That is not your title. You should not have done that to her like that. All right. What the fuck was that? Sammy Ken is what she said she is, and she is forced to win that title. A setup. I have to go help out really quick. Oh, so it is like that. Oh, oh God! Say this. Oh, Slay, Slay right went now. to go. I guess check on her now. Great. Well, I'm, that. Uh, I'm just gonna say this right now. I'm going ah. to be filing a restraining order against Ava Moreno because that is a one fucking crazy hoe. I don't think she's done anything crazy with you. I think the only one she's fucked with is either me or fucking D Mob. I'm filing. <laughs> I'm filing a restraining order for D Mob. I don't. I don't. <laughs> 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 Oh, damn, Bill. I laid out. Uh, I just want to say, Slate, uh... Well, uh, but, like, I just want to say... <coughs> oh, excuse did, me. Did, did, did Ava Moreno, uh, attack her a couple of weeks ago? No, she attacked her. her. She attacked her twice. That's what I was saying. I'm actually surprised yeah, to see yeah. that Sammy uh, can't actually time, coming back with her own time, stuff. Hey, I'm hey, man. On a lot of those shows I was fighting, I had no idea. Don't blame me. Wah. And you're like, right. you're like, wait, wait, what? Wait, what are you talking about here? I'm confused. I'm so lost right now, I'll be honest with you. I don't know what they're setting up. But either way, uh, it is now on to the next match. So, for the past couple weeks, and yes, we know it's probably been happening a lot, uh, Justin has been trying to crack the mold of uh, what's probably going on with Devil because we don't understand if Devil is being manipulated by the unholy or <laughs> if it's just actual <coughs> Devil acting on his own fucking uh, well-being. Because right now he is being tested by Michael Wolf and Jacob Tristan Wildfire. Um, with that said though, we couldn't find Devil tonight? So, with that said, uh, we had to find someone else to Justin to fight. And it's a surprise opponent! Oh. Surprise! 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 No, no, huh. this one was a, this one was a surprise because of the rivalry. I didn't know who it was gonna be. Surprise! Motherfucker! Well, so, surprise. guys, guys, let's talk about Justin real quick. Justin has not had a good career here in PXC. No, let's be honest not here. Really. Yeah. But but Justin elsewhere has had. A Oh yeah, I mean in WWE, everything. That like, don't get me wrong, he's had a successful wrestling career, but in PXT, I mean, the question should be asked now: Is it his time? My 
And sadly, for this, I'd actually have to agree. A man like Justin, somewhat of a legend in WWE, he should have put the boots away a while back. But it seems like this guy doesn't see the end of his career. He only and, uh, wants to create a legacy. I agree on that. Because, uh, I mean, hell, he's gone through, God, he's gone through so many matches. There's been times to where he's almost picked up, like, a big, big victory. But like he always he comes up short. Yeah, he always comes up short. Um, with that I said, though, it, I think he wants to be like the legendary luchadors of the time, especially like Rey Mysterio. Oh, actually, that was one of his mentors. Actually, he's trying to live up to the legacy of his mentor, then the mentor of the the great Rey Mysterio. Right, and also, uh, I also have something that I want to announce to you guys here on the call tonight. No. Uh, I knew it. He's having a kid. <laughs> it's concerning GMD Mob. Da -da -da. Oh. Yeah. Yeah. oh. Oh, he's dead. Who we got here? He's oh, fucking dead. He's not. Yeah, he's dead. <laughs> it is, it is, it is oh, the former. It is the former <laughs> pre XT champion. Dear God. Mr. Blue the we Mr. we actually haven't seen Rodrigo in a fucking oh, minute, yeah. actually. Talk about Blue Tista. What? Is that? Blue Tista. <laughs> I'm actually excited to see Rodrigo tonight. We have not seen him in a long time, and it seems like the crowd actually likes to see him too. Yeah, now, Mr. We, beefed up and all. We have not seen Rodrigo in a he? long ass. Damn man, Hunter, he's, is so he is the perfect <laughs> apex predator. No, that's a lie. Uh, no, he's he's just. Oh, oh. Whoa, whoa, that guys, the fuck. <laughs> <laughs> See, for people, the people in the stream, y'all didn't hear me actually put my mic to my mouth and just say that, but I will try to reenact what just happened. Guys, the fuck. That is what they heard. <laughs> if it sounded like what it sounded like. Hey, all I said was beefy. God, God damn it. Why do you want to fuck all my characters? <laughs> you cannot God. tell me that's not one beefy dude. Oh, of course he's a beefy guy. That's all. That's him and his five brothers. Five? Yeah, he spotted the... God damn it, what is it? Quadruplets? Quadruplets? Quadruplets, or something like that. No, not quadruplets, quadruplets. that's four. Quadruplets, yeah. Let's get into the match here, and Justin, right out of the gate, is actually finding some success. Isn't it? Ah, uh, well, right when you say that. Hey, look at that, the curse went to you. <laughs> yeah, you well, shit. shut the fuck up, you shut the fuck up for the rest of the night, goddammit, fuck you. <laughs> what the All right, fuck great. is going on? I know exactly when I'm going to start saying stuff now. God damn it! Well, right, you know, I guess. We already know what we did on purpose. <laughs> God damn it! Let's get into the match, guys. Justin already going with a springboard crossbody, goes for a pin off of the former PXT champion. Now, people don't know, Rodrigo was our inaugural PXT champion for this run of PXT. Oh my God! Big clothesline. Yeah, because PXT started a uh, goddamn almost five years ago. It was a one-time thing. Bugrip was actually supposed to be the one to carry the staple of PXT champion. But we had gone bankrupt, <laughs> and now we're back. Yeah. And now. Uh, thanks to me. No, I'm kidding. Um, I was, I'm, I'm mainly gonna say it was my determination. Well, that mean. Like, <laughs> well, 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 and a little like, help from that DMOB. I'm still and taking all the credits, especially the only fans. Yeah, the and only and fans, fans did it the <laughs> most. Rodrigo's right. ass cheeks get so much cells off the only thing. God fucking damn it! Rodrigo Kenny Justin and a bear hug on the outside looking to wear down the luchador. God fucking oh, he so damn bad. it. He gets so bad when me and Rocky add on to it. Okay. <laughs> I get mad when I add on to it. That's when I get pissed. <laughs> Son of a four. Fuck you, Rob, God damn it. Hey, you, uh, you. You can get oh, God. nudes at hashtag beefcake on OnlyFans. Oh, wait. Oh, wait, while you go. Getting Justin in a big spear. I'm Is that enough? One, big two. Spear. No. no. Justin kicks out. 
Right now, Rodrigo has had peer control this match. Don't say it's Justin, like is, Justin is Justin. Got it. Uh, Rodrigo has full control of this match. Hey, look at that. It does work. <laughs> <laughs> it's beautiful. <laughs> you know, oh, he was going for a lava latch. Rodrigo is in real control of this match. You don't have that curse. No, you're people. doing it on purpose. That's why it's not working for you. Yeah, yeah, no, yeah, yeah. Because I, I, you have See, to say it like when it's not intentional. It purpose. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> <laughs> you're gonna do it on purpose. <laughs> All right. All right. Oh my God. Right now, Justin, getting back into the match. No, 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 no. I'm not saying it, I'm just saying he's getting back into the match. But his cockiness you know gets ahead of him. God damn it. So, so, so going on, uh, going on about this match, do you feel like that the Unholy had something to do with this matchup, or do you think this matchup just kind of happened? Uh, honestly, I, I will say yet. that this match kind of happened. The Unholy might have been... Okay, can I talk real quick? <laughs> the Unholy, no. I don't think, had anything with Rodrigo taking part of this. I think they had probably something to do with Devil's disappearance right now. Oh. That was back in hell. But did they do it originally at Oh, shit! Probably not. Wait, what? But what the he heck? Disappeared at, he disappeared in Hellfire and then came back at Abyss. Yes, but in this case, I, I don't think that's what's happening right now with Devil. I don't think it's a long hiatus disappearance. Fair point. I think tonight we just literally couldn't find him. So that's why we're getting Justin versus Rodrigo here tonight. And uh, sells a very questionable clothesline. What the fuck was it? What? I have no idea. Well, That's why I say it questionable. That is why I say it very, very questionable it's close been a decently line. good match so far. <laughs> Honestly, better than I expected. I expected just to get fucking mode. like he just, like, grazed his chin. Like, <laughs> softly. <laughs> that, is, that is actually what it looked like. No. What? Okay, we're at a count of six. Justin. Justin was holding his own, but Rodrigo is now tossing Justin back into the ring. I can't count for the life of me. I All right, now Justin forward. going for another sunset flip power bomb off of Rodrigo. Isn't that like the third one he's hit in this match? Looks yes. Like yeah, it really is. Like, wow. Look, look, he was taught by Rey Mysterio. He wasn't taught a lot. <laughs> yeah, we can tell. Oh, God. Lost record. What? God damn. <laughs> Had to roast the man that bad? No. Oh, no, he, no, no, he's, no, he's insulting they're, Justin they're at this insulted. point. <laughs> We're insulting Justin, not, not, not Ray yeah, Mysterio. Face. Yeah. Because yeah, right now, Justin, uh, Justin, at least PXC wise, has really failed to, like, kick off. He's had opportunities, it's just he hasn't really, like, seized the moment. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. I have a feeling he'll, he'll be able to seize the moment. But these double Oof. His, his his double foot stomps he's hitting right now to the chest and to the arm is he's really doing some dealing damage. Dealing a lot to of damage. Rodrigo. Yeah, exactly. Just trying. No, to, I think right now. Rodrigo he's hasn't to, been in, hasn't been in competition for a while. And this is true. I just think he's trying to weaken down that body of Rodrigo. He knows I what he has to do. Well, I mean, just that. his first win here in tw in twenty twenty four in PXC. Uh, probably not. Let's <laughs> be honest since, here. Probably not. Uh, does he have a win like, on his record, actually? Yeah, it was Hellfire. He won with Devil. Technically, Devil's the one that got the pin on that one, so he sort of gave him a win. He still technically got the win. Uh, win win wise, I actually don't know. I believe it was. If he does have another win under his belt, because I think he has two wins. I believe it might have been against Ace. Because it's, it's the only person I can see him actually defeating. But I actually don't remember who Justin uh, went off against to get that second victory. Oh, God. Rodrigo just dropping Justin face first on the apron right now. Just it's full on fight just to, on the outside. This is brutal just a full brawl. On brawl. Mm -hmm. Rodrigo getting Justin up. This is what a, this is 
is what a good old Stone Cold would say is a barroom brawl. It's not Stone Cold. <laughs> what? Big power slam to Justin. Is that up? Take him out. No, Justin kicks out. Rodrigo, Rodrigo. Man, a wobble at you. He already hit the spear and he doesn't oh. work. Oh, actually goes in for an old fashioned Samoan drop. Oh, interesting. He's not Samoan. Hey, look, he loves the move, okay? <laughs> People who, who aren't Samoan can hit it. Yeah. 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 It's just a maneuver. Cool shit. Big snap oh. DDT in right now. Justin. <laughs> Justin coming back at it. Could this be the opportune moment he needs? He needs to hit okay. that cork corkscrew senton of his. If he can hit that, yeah. He could probably put down Rodrigo. Oh, but Rodrigo. <laughs> Being the quick blue menace that he is. Is it with another oh rolling neck breaker? I'm sorry, but is just taller than Rodrigo? I actually don't know. Also, bringing forth wall wise, uh, this is the first time these two have actually ever gone against each other. Oh, wow. Like, I, in, like even before I did PXT. Like well, no, because I think they gone against each other in this one, but one on one wise, oh, no, I. Th uh oh, oh that Ooh. might be it. Surprisingly, it was not. Uh, oh, well, now this one might be a devil setting him up for a third spear. Who? Possibly to devil, put down. Wait, wait. Oh, that's a devil? Yeah, sorry. <laughs> sorry, Rodrigo. <laughs> that is enough to put Justin out. And Justin is... Wait, what? Justin's up. He's oh, looking disappointed. Wait. Justin okay, the lights are actually out this time. Awesome. The devil's in the <laughs> ring! <laughs> oh, God. Here comes. Devil. Holy shit. It gets him up and hits him with a big. God damn. Well. That's your brother, you piece of shit. That's your Maybe brother, not in God his eyes. God. God damn. No remorse. Son of a bitch. Anyways, take any. Uh, with just what happened, we still can't take anything away from Justin. He went toe to toe with one of the, a former and the first PFC champion and hold his and hey. held his own. Hey, you, you want to know something? Hmm. What? Respect is not given. Respect is earned. And at this moment in time, Justin just has not earned the respect that he needs to earn with the rest of the roster. That he deserves uh, to earn. Oh yeah, no, everyone in the locker room thinks he's a joke. I'm not going to lie to you. Exactly. Everyone in the locker room exactly. thinks he's a joke. Exactly. Oh, except Morales. Except Morales. No, everyone. <laughs> I'll be honest with you. Everyone. <laughs> like when, I, when, I, when I speak of Justin, this is what they say. <laughs> that is what they say. <laughs> No, no, not who. They just go. They, they, they fucking laugh. Because <laughs> Justin, Justin's record is not the best here in PXC. Let's be a hundred percent honest here. Really not. Um, but I, I think uh, he is a joke. God, <laughs> even Drew said it. <laughs> Sadly. Damn. <laughs> and now he is the daddy of P. Hey. Okay, I'm not well, with that said, I'm with that said, that. with that said, ladies and gentlemen, it's time for us to actually um, uphold the name of this episode because it is time for our first hardcore match of the night, and it is <laughs> between <laughs> a member of the War Machines going against a member of. The Outcast. That's right, ladies and gentlemen, tonight it is the icon of wrestling and hardcore D Mob going one on one against the Outcast, Shane Henry. Thank you. Harry. 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 Oh, Jesus. Now these types of matches are D Mob's bread and butter. So how do we think yes, Shane, they Shane do. Henry's? They go fair. together. They go together like a Big Mac with some fries. <laughs> they go together like sugar and 
Kool-Aid. They go okay, together. We get it. We get it, goddamn. Oh, no, I don't know why so <laughs> so I go hell. Oh. No, I was gonna say for some reason every time you go to the accent, I keep thinking of you like the Soul Train guy. <laughs> that, that is the whole entire point of this, and we go together like peanut butter and jelly jelly. God damn it! Just <laughs> <laughs> oh man. D mob, woo! Del Tree's going for D mob. Shut the fuck up, dude. <laughs> <laughs> and as you can see, he wears the badge of honor. No. No, I do gotta I do gotta say this though. Uh, between like the war machines and the fucking outcasts, these two are the ones that have been wanting to fight each other the most. So I was just like, well, let's give them a sneak peek at what Brush is gonna be here tonight. Because even later tonight, our second hardcore match of the night, ladies and gentlemen, is actually gonna be between Jack Flo against Michael Slade here tonight. That's why both of them yep. are out here tonight. Now let me ask you a question. Up. How do you feel that this will affect the war machine going in, uh, Mr. Harry, if they well, get Mr. the win tonight? Well, uh, Mr. Uh, Tiny Pee Pee, um... <laughs> she sounds like he's three. <laughs> so, so who says he sounds like he's three? Uh, if they win, you <laughs> Oh, there he is. One half of the Outcast and one half of the PXT Tag Team Champions. But actually, going into the question, if they win here tonight, it'll be a huge accolade for them and they'll have a lot of momentum moving forward into it. But if they lose, it might be bad. We'll have to work together and figure out like, a true, difficult strategy that but, 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 but what if, what if D Mob and Michael Slay had an ultimate plan when they asked for this match here tonight? What if they are working they did not out ask the Yeah, I was gonna say, no, yeah, no, one no one asked for this match. I was just like, well, let's give everyone a sneak peek for a rush. What would you do? Okay. Did D Mob be the ring veteran that he is? What if D Mob is just trying to scout out your weak spots here tonight? If he is, you know, him being the hardcore weak spot here tonight. If he is him being the hardcore icon, I would expect nothing less from him. But if Shane can somehow pull a win here tonight, it will just further send him up. And notice, the PXC universe right now is booing the shit out of Shane. Yeah, no, they they do not like Shane right now, mainly because of uh hell, the, what how how far he's been going a little bit overboard here in PXT. I mean, hell, like two weeks ago he went and attacked uh, both Michael Slade and Abcole after the match was already decided. Uh, Michael Slade tried giving that uh, craziness back, but failed at it, and now <laughs> Shane hitting Demob oh, head first with a fucking table. Oh, dear God. Wow. You know, Shane is, uh, Shane is just controlling this match right now. Hey, look at that. I said, I said the word. That oh, see, there it is. See, there it is. Now you did it. What the say fuck? Else, <laughs> Don't say anything else. <laughs> okay, well, got you. From what Shane has said. Yeah, that's what I was about to say, Demo. He, he now he did the not... move in front of me. I don't know why I've never seen you do it before. Unless I'm just stupid, yeah. I don't know. <laughs> yeah, that, 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 that is like one of my bread and butter moves. That's how, like all of my characters. Yeah. Yeah. I'm not gonna lie, uh, half of the movesets cool. on most of my dudes, oh my I don't God. even know what they are sometimes. God damn, I, I wanna say- I, 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 Like, if you notice, like, like my playstyle and stuff, like, cause, like, you know, I actually play and stuff. And, like, so, like, I'll, like, work out my moveset and stuff, like, you know, like, like I go through the whole until, like, when I edit a moveset, y'all, I fucking- Edit a moveset. Like, I don't bullshit around. Like, for real. Don't say a fucking thing, Rocky. I know what you're gonna say. Don't say a thing. Right now, D Mob is in pure control of this match. I'm over here. Oh, God. Like, exactly oh my God. Exactly uh, D Mob is taking a little bit too much control of this match and has already busted <laughs> open up, Shane Henry. Ooh. Now, the question is is that gonna fire Shane up? 
And it looks like it is. It looks like Debo might have just opened the floodgates here. My God, oh, big snap suplex. <laughs> you're just look, you're just looking out, just like, please come out, please, please. Please, hopefully. Do you remember please. the war machines? No. <laughs> <laughs> that'd, be, that'd be a strange fucking like uh, exclusion. Uh, that's that's it's breaking that's breaking fourth wall there, but that'd be a strange one. <laughs> summer, summer, come out. God damn it! <laughs> it's Lorraine. 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 <laughs> Lorraine. Right now. Fuck you! What? God damn it! God damn it! Ass. God damn it! <laughs> kick y'all's ass. I want to say this, d is showing why he's the hardcore icon. Because, goddamn. Yeah, Shane Shane is having trouble keeping up against d Because this thing, when d first debuted, dude, he had resilience in these type of matches like crazy. Oh, I still remember Michael Slade and d in the hardcore like title match. That shit was fucking fire. <laughs> let's, let's talk about their very first match. That was a come from behind match. Oh come yeah. Wait, 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 what? Wait, what? Huh? <laughs> what? <laughs> look, look, D Mob had dominated that whole entire match and it took one uh verdict to put down D Mob. Oh the crowd is asking for tables. We but Shane win. says screw it and brings out a ladder and immediately I don't know what D Bob was doing. I think D Bob was challenging Shane to hit him, scrape in the face with the ladder, and now <laughs> it just fired D Bob up because D Bob just takes fucking Shane and throws him around like fucking nothing. Holy shit, dude. Damn, dude. Dear God. I think, Damn, I think Shane is starting I think Shane's starting to realize that he might have made a mistake choosing this match. Oh shut oh. the fuck up. He'll be fine. He's not competing for the title, though. Well, we can say that we can say this. D Mob's not good at baseball because he missed a big <laughs> fucking swing, and now. <laughs> he... <laughs> oh, yeah, 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 oh, but hit Shane with his own Assassin's Creed. Is that oh enough? One, the two, 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 no, no. Shane the kicks out. D Mob. Wow. So, a show of disrespect. Made, he just made a mockery of the Assassin's Creed. But I'm pretty sure, didn't he hit Michael Slade with the uh, Old Fashioned a couple weeks ago? Oh, he hit him with a final verdict. That's what he hit him with last week. Oh. Yeah, yeah, Shane yeah. hitting that scoop explode around in the... Oh, and now Shane getting a steel chair straight to the face of D-Mob, and D-Mob immediately gets up. This is what I'm talking about, oh. about his fucking reserve, and now gets Shane into a sleeper hold. Are we going to see Shane possibly pass oh. out here tonight? Oh, no. I don't think we're going to see it. No, Shane. Able to get out of it. And now coming in with his own assault. Henry, you'll never choke that man out. My God! He hit an old fashioned when he broke out of it, ish maybe. Who knows? Yeah, I was gonna say he got out of it, and now Shane showing that he's a lot better at baseball than D Mob. I actually <laughs> I played baseball for a long time. I did too, so. actually. In, in real life, yeah. <laughs> oh, I think I think D I think D Mob was trying to go for an old fashioned, but Shane was able to see it coming. It goes for a suicide dive to the outside. Oh, just a big Pele kick to the back of the head. Seems like Shane's really coming back in this match. Who knows? Who knows? Honestly, I, I gotta say that uh, it is showing that these two men are gonna be <laughs> probably the two to look for or look at it's in that match. Like, match holy at, shit. At rush. It really is. Be one hell of a match. Now the question is, is it gonna be elimination? Do, 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 do. No, I'm joking. <laughs> Please? Uh, <laughs> Please. <laughs> Shane, Shane said that yes, it will oh. be an elimination match. Just to yeah, I was gonna say because he has stipulations, so he gets to say with that. So okay, there you go. It's elimination. <laughs> what? You're oh. fucking welcome, Gabe. Fucking remember. Him. Oh wait, but Shane getting him with a big right. clothesline and now goes to the pin on D Mob, and is enough to put down D Mob. What? 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 To be fair, what? to be fair, it looked like the back of your head did hit a portion of the table. Like the metal part when it was like just face down, it looked like the back of your head did hit that a little bit. 
Look at that, Shane Henry. I want to point out, Shane's going in with a lot of fucking momentum into fucking really? Rush. Because not only did he beat Michael Slade, he beat D-Mob at his own fucking game. And the chat is not happy with it. God damn it. Recognize that means that that's not even the newest chain. I know that much because it's, it's not the new entrance. Well, ladies and gentlemen, saving it for Rush, dipshit. <laughs> Damn it. Uh, <laughs> so, <laughs> so, <laughs> we have the title around there, so that's the one I film around. The title around. <laughs> Alright, so real quick. So you can't see us, you're real. Oh, shit. God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. <laughs> God damn it. Okay, real quick. Uh, Recently, this past episode of MTW, it was Gold Rush. In other words, we were crowning champions left and fucking right. And yes, that is where we, we unveiled, that is where we unveiled the PXT Bond map as well. Uh, to where one team really made their name, uh, name change, very, very aware. Which, no, I, they might actually still come out as the nation on this one because I don't think I updated it on this one. <laughs> But they have been slowly just calling themselves Domination. The team of Super and Titan were able to pick up the MTW Tag Team Championships. And now they are looking to become Double Crowns, the tag team. They gotta get past the War Machine first. They did. <laughs> you forgot. You forgot. You guys were, you guys were in that shit too. And y'all fucking got fucked. <laughs> Yeah, wham! Oh, I didn't even talk. I didn't even talk about the other team they're fighting against. <laughs> because that one wasn't a surprise. <laughs> there is a new tag team forming, and it is a tag team of champion. Not really. The cha champions in other promotions, not here in PXC. Um, in other words, it is a former PXC champion and former multi-time champion. View grip and a oh wow these cocky fuckers. <laughs> they did what Electro hasn't even done yet, and they came out with the MTW Tag Team Championships. <laughs> Look at uh, them beautiful titles, bro. And that's what I was about uh, to say to want to point out that these titles were created by the man in our booth right now, D Mob, and he did exceptionally yeah, yeah, well did. with welcome. all these titles. Shane did not I do shit when it comes to MTW. No, I'm just kidding. I tell you, I spent a, like almost a full 24 hours all he night did. reworking titles. He like, pretty much did, yeah. For <laughs> and for that, D-Mob, can we get a justice for chocolate milk? No. <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, fuck you, <laughs> I want to point out the nation. Or uh, fucking... Honestly, they surprised me in that thing, because holy shit, dude, I did hey, not Spoo, think they were going to make it as Spoo, well as they did. What do you think about those belts? Those belts look fire, man. Yeah. Awesome. But now, with that said, though, with that said, though, how long are they going to hold those titles? You, you did it! You set me up for failure, bro! I but now they gotta go against- old. They gotta go you against a team that, that- These guys have been a team in the past, and they have actually been very fucking good. The team of Bugrip and his partner, Adonis. Oh, we had two big returns here tonight. Bugrip and Rodrigo were not starting that so, rivalry. So, so, so. <laughs> Pugrip, man. Pugrip. Pugrip. Why does it look was... Like? Here comes the Pugrip. Pugrip uh, was our inaugural, our oh, first Pugrip. actual Pugrip. inaugural PXT oh. champion. But Pugrip. when we went... <laughs> God damn it. But when we went bankrupt, uh, we had to take the title off of him. So, with that said, he had been in that tournament. He didn't make it out of the qualifiers. But he won a battle royale with Rodrigo in it as well. They were the final two, picked up the victory, and then went to Biowar to fucking squash Rodrigo in an Iron Man match. An hour-long Iron Man match, I point out. Yeah, why didn't you do that? Who knows? That Who knows? Maybe... Hey, it was maybe a fun match. Maybe those will come back. 
No. You're Honestly, no, no, the Iron Man matches, yeah, those are still open. Honestly, I'm okay with doing like an hour long one, if so, because I mean, they're not over. It's no, really, uh, it's really the last man standing. Because I, I, I did a, I did an Iron Man match. The last man standing. They, they leave the guys on the ground. The last man standing. Yeah, last man standing. Yeah, last man standing is terrible. That's why we're never doing that again. Um, but it's, like, it's all the way to a count of ten. That's kind of. Funny. Yeah, but they kept on getting up at eight. Oh, he's gonna at do eight. The at flip. eight. He did it. He did the. <laughs> <laughs> that was him saying suck my dick. What are you talking about? No, <laughs> All this thing is, don't threaten Dima with a dick. I, I'm not gonna lie to you. Know, I'm actually, in, God damn it. I'm actually impressed these two are coming back. Here comes a, this son of a bitch. This cocky and arrogant son of a bitch. It's Adonis. Now, oh, hey, I, hey. Oh, no, go ahead. No, you can go ahead. What up? Uh, yeah, we were trying to confirm something earlier about, uh, Cassidy, remember? What was that? Oh my god, are you talking about the long-lost brother shit? Mm -hmm. <laughs> you say it's Adonis, I swear to god! No, it's not. It's not. Okay. Okay, well, okay, we'll talk about that part later. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you might have to talk to... Uh, you might have to talk to... Uh, you might have to talk about it to a certain someone. Well, uh, with, with that with that said, though, um, these guys have been a tag team in uh, other promotions, and they've had success. Uh, they don't ever name themselves as a team. They just go by Adonis and Bugrip. And, uh, hell, they could probably do it again here in PXC. Who knows? They'd shake the tag team world. That, or they become jobbers. Who knows? That, who knows? They might just be jobbers. We don't know. Who knows? We don't Maybe really they can have mix. jobbers here in PXC. Let's be honest. I was gonna say Adonis. Well, eh, let's see. Justin. <laughs> Justin. At this point, Justin and Ace, they are jobbers, sadly. At least no, I also, guys. Well, I also want to point out, um, this is actually interesting, too, because this is a PXD tournament uh, qualifiers little rematch right here between Bugrip and Super. Super actually wow. came out on top against uh Bugrip in the qualifiers in that tournament super but this time super can go for all the count outs he wants hey cyclone when you get a minute check your phone i'll check it in 20 years all right but right, right well, now no, 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 no. I, I have a question for you <laughs> well, like i asked a legit question i didn't i didn't want to ask out loud because i didn't want to fuck anything up yeah I wouldn't even say he looks like him, though. <laughs> the face! Uh, yeah. Look at the face! <laughs> I still Are wouldn't say he looks like him. Cassidy? No, no, he's saying, no, he's saying Bugrip looks like C. Jill. In the face. Look at the face. I can't, because his face is on the mat getting butt <laughs> <laughs> Imagine him with short hair and it slicked like C. Joe. He would look like C. Joe in the face. I mean, I guess? <laughs> but then again, that's a lot you of the creative characters, it. honestly. I just I like like I just think it's a like like a coincidence. But like it, 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 it it's a cool little Easter egg. Oh thing. well you know what? They might have the same hair now that you say that. That might be what it is. Actually. Yeah, yeah. I think they had the same hair because I couldn't find one that fit uh, C. Jill well enough. So I might have used the same hair, but I never that noticed it because their what, faces. That might be what it is. Yeah, but I never noticed it because th their faces look so different. So that's why I never paid no mind. I don't know, dude. <laughs> like, like I see that. I was like. <laughs> wait, wait. Have you never seen Bugrip? I swear we've had him on here no, when you were I don't on. Think I have. That's crazy. I swore he's been on here when you've been commentating. Maybe I just I don't think remember. He has. I think he is. Maybe I, I do not know remember. who that is. Uh, has it been a while since I've seen him? Maybe that, or he's been in big ma oh not big matches. He's been in big shows and multi mans, and that's probably why. Oh shit! I gotta get props though. He's actually tanking the uh, the domination Yo. pretty well though. 
You know who that was, don't you? No. <laughs> That's why I'm paying that, no that, mind. That, that, that was uh, 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 Lord uh, Lord Demos. Oh, is that who that is? Oh. Yeah. Who's that? I that was a, that was in P A uh, M T W. M T W. Yeah. His move set was pure. It was garbage. Like it was worse than a Shane Henry move set. Oh well, fuck Damn. Damn. <laughs> the fucking the awesome. fucking the fucking Cyclone. beef continues. <laughs> Cyclone, uh, be be for real though. Like tell tell me Hunter. how garbage his move set was. Like it was just pure. I'll like, be spamming. honest with you, D Mob. I generally don't remember. You don't remember? We I, I like genuinely don't. I remember I like. I remember I like the look of his character and everything. Yeah. The yeah. Kind of badass. What? Right now, I, I okay. I gotta say this: Bugrip is actually tanking both members of Domination pretty fucking well. I'm sorry. I had, I, I, had a, uh, I had a Booker team moment. What? What was going on? Stop! Wake up, Rocky. Wake we were up. talking. To, we were talking about drugs. Right now, Bugrip. Uh -oh. I was just saying oh. that Bugle was actually like holding his own against both members of Domination pretty well. Where Adonis hasn't even had to come in. Yeah, I mean, I had my Booker T moment. I had to go pee pee. But hey. <laughs> Pull a Jerry Lawler and pee your pants. Fuck no. <laughs> I'm not as dedicated as, so, the, as you know JR. You know something that I just realized? So. What about, uh, 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 which one's in the ring right now? Uh, uh is, is it? Is, are we talking about the Spartan looking guy? Are we talking about the guy in yeah. all black? Oh, Titan. So, so, so is he wearing oh, shit. boots or are those like sandals? Those are Spartan cleats! They're sand oh. boots. Sand boots. Sleep sandal over boots. Them. Something sand like that. I don't know. I always the call them like. Sand, sand, sand boots. boots. There you go. Sand oh, boots. shit. Big sling blade. It's coarse, hey. rugged, and it gets everywhere. <laughs> <laughs> I always say that when anybody says they hate the beach or sand. <laughs> I always say it. Oh, wait, Adonis connecting with a key enzyme off of Super. One, two, no. We rarely get to see the key enzyme, actually. Monkey. Monkey. See oh, guys, damn. This, is how you, this is how you get Shane to stop being an act. You just say monkey. He just <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, wait, wait, Adonis actually soloing them right now? He just took oh, out Adonis Titan! Is soloing. He just took out Titan and now turns his attention to Super! It's the key here. ends up. Oh wait, wait. It's, it's a Mach 2 off of oh, Super! But Super gets right back up. One! Two! No! <laughs> Only gets a one count. Oh my god! I'm. Oh, I think he was trying to go for the Adonis drop. Doesn't connect with it though. Uh oh, Super got him off for Adonis a big choke seen... slam. Adonis has seen success with the Adonis drop throughout his career. Yes, sir. Oh yeah, hell. I mean, like like I said, we all thought he was gonna be the one to put down C. Jill when he was undefeated. <laughs> But then he let everybody down. But with that said, though, I mean, shit, that doesn't take away that he can hold his own against, like, big fucking opponents. Not to mention, he was the one that stopped the momentum of the former tag team champions. Wait, who, who are we talking about? You know, who really stops. <laughs> oh, actually, yeah, now you, now you say that. That's actually true. Who knows? Maybe he was the cause of the downfall of the Wolfpack now thinking about it. Now, genuinely, well, genuinely thinking about it, Adonis did stop the momentum. Girl? Oh wait! Oh wait! Oh wait! Oh, oh, wait. oh my God! Adonis lifts up Titan. Don't, don't Titan was trying to go for Titanfall, but Adonis showing his absolute strength. Holy shit! Alabama slam. Oh, was trying to take care of Super, but <laughs> Super not gonna have it. My god. Honestly, Adonis really surprising me here tonight. Holy shit. Adonis, for once, I think it's because he knows that he can't count his va his way out of this one. Oh, uh, that's true. He can't monkey his way out. God damn it. 
Why, why is that it? <laughs> it's, 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 like my, it's like my nephew it's, with poop. It's, it's confirmed. <laughs> <laughs> God <laughs> fucking <laughs> damn it, guys, we're adults! Super Uranagi! Is that enough to put down Adonis? <laughs> it's confirmed. Rocky's gonna come back with a shirt that says... <laughs> <laughs> Puke saves. No, Puke no, saves no, no. the fuck. It has to say. It has to say. Monkey poop. God. God. Monkey. Fucking. Oh. Oh. Damn it. All oh. your fine four thousand dollars for laughing at the word poop. <laughs> 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 oh my god! Dude, I am getting really impressed with Adonis right now! Holy wow, shit! Adonis really is. Adonis is really guess what? what? Oh, sir. oh, wait, oh, I think, oh! I think Bugrip was trying to go for the Bugrip, but misses it entirely! Looks like he was... We gotta remember, Bugrip has not been in action for a while. Yeah, it, it, has, it has been a minute. Oh wait, what, what the hell is Titan doing? I think Titan was talking shit to Adonis. Can you imagine if these two actually pick up a win against the MTW World Tag Team Champions? Can you fucking imagine that? So, I mean, so what would that mean for them? Oh, no. that, just, that just proves that they're an unstoppable force at that point. That proves that the nation has always been frauds. The who? You mean All right. Oh, Adonis oh, yeah. goes for another Mach 2 off Super 1, but Titan was already up and ready to save the pin. No, I'm and sorry, this... not Domination Penetration. It is Domination. That is their name. <laughs> they are Domination. And they dominate. Domination. Oh, right now. Let's oh! Remember. The Adonis taking out Titan and now goes with a sling blade off of Super oh and hits a big hands on off of Super. Uh -oh. Uh -oh. Is that enough? Is that one? Uh -oh. No, Titan was able to get wow. up and save the win. Oh my god. Damn. Dude, a dumb man. Okay, maybe I should just leave these two as a tag team because holy fuck, dude, I'll, they're actually doing really well. You, I think at this point, Adonis is starting to win the respect back from the crowd. Shit, practically. Oh, and again, takes care I of... I thought that was Abcole. No, that's Adonis. <laughs> Why does everyone confuse these guys? <laughs> no, I, thought Ab I thought Abcole was the one who did the whole thing with CGO. Oh, okay. Wait, what? Does the oh. Wait, does the famous what? The... <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I don't even know what, what he did. I don't even know what, what happened. He... I truly don't know what happened. Oh wait, the Donna thing that's enough goes with a pin off super, but Titan that sort of fucks up the ref there. Uh, that might actually bode well, bad for them because uh, ref. yeah, this this ref has a history. <laughs> this ref literally has a history of fucking over matches. <laughs> I want to like, point out. What? <laughs> is, is it just the what? Is that what, is that what the laughing is? Why y'all giggling like what the? Oh my like, god! Like, monkey, monkey, be mom. That's god not my it. word. God damn it! I gotta get props to both Adonis and Bugrip. They are showing they can solo the team of like Adonis Super and Titan. Pulling it out. And Adonis is here pulling comes out. Bugrip. Adonis is pulling out, Rocky? That's you. See, he's doing this now. I'm done. I'm not doing it. Dude, this is crazy. Oh, wait. Oh, wait. Super has. Oh, my. Bugle about hits it with a big Super Uranagi. Is that enough to end this Super match? No. It. Adonis it. coming in to save. But now Titan looking to take care of the Adonis problem. Instead of the Adonis drop, it's the Adonis problem. Oh, oh my god, Super's up! Super's up! Big! Oh, no, misses oh. a big knee shot! And now Bugrip looking for Bugrip of a Super! Let's go! Uh oh. One! Two! Two! No! Super kicks out! Oh my god, he's not done! He's not done! He's not done! That's another one straight back after! 
<laughs> super, super has to be fucking done, dude. Okay. Super has to be. Two few grips. Oh, now B grip is there taking is, there care is, of I was, the Titan problem. Was trying to, Adonis though, I think was trying to do something. I'm not sure what exactly was going on there. And now, Bugrip going to the top. I think Titan's trying to fuck over Bugrip. But let's get it. Oh, but now finally. Screws Ooh. over Bugrip. Oh, so he's the reason I couldn't do what I was going oh. to do. Oh. What's the what? Oh no. You don't oh, know big that. power bomb right there. Is that oh. another put? Super out one, dude. Super's done. Super's practically done in this match at this yeah, point. Super's practically fucking dead. Start the funeral. Right now, get right now, Titan's out. Right now, Titan's out. Let's hit one more view grip. That's all you need. He's actually not doing that. He's immediately tagging in Adonis. For the Adon for the Kianzon. He's doing it for the Kianzon. Either the Kianzon or the Adonis drop, but they're wasting time. I want to see the mock too. There it is, there it is. Are we gonna see it? No, super! Yeah. Fighting out of it, yeah. somehow fighting out! Oh Same wow, like oh the, wow! The nation is proving oh, I'm sorry, domination is penetration that they are not to be pushed around anymore. Honestly, it's showing that uh, they're probably not the best tag team, is what they're saying. Because holy shit, two guys that aren't. <laughs> Don't get me wrong, they tag team in the past, but it's been a while. Are actually standing tall over the MTW World Tag Team Champions. Oh, and look at Adonis. He's trying to go for a count out, I think. Oh! Show a little disrespect. On a big one. Are we gonna? Th okay, I thought we were gonna probably see a third one there. Ooh. Oh, but he hit the ref. He hit the, the ref. Backbreaker. But now Titan is up the again. Backbreaker. Oh. We just. Super oh wait! Bounces. Oh wait! I don't think Bugrip saw it. And uh, oh, Bugrip, Bugrip. Uh, I think Bugrip's having some mental problems right there because uh, yeah, I don't know why he did that. <laughs> he isn't having mental problems. <laughs> My God! Easily lifts up the Titan and sends it flying. What the hell? I am genuinely oh, impressed. Now this seems doing well, and now gets a Titan with a pew grip. Oh, it's super. Oh, oh, no. Doesn't end it though. And now, oh, I don't know what the. Okay. Now both again, both of them down, both of them out. Oh, Adonis tagged oh, in. Man. Adonis tagged in. Can Adonis end this match here? No, I know. Oh, it's the super Spanish fly suplex. Beautiful. Oh. Beautiful by the big a man. A big man hitting that. I just oh. My pants. Oh. This might be it for Adonis Titanfall. Oh. Oh. Just the way. One. Oh my God. Holy oh. shit, dude. Bugrip fucking flew, man. He fucking flew. He took a page out of a Rocky's book. <laughs> A big man like Bugrip is not going to let this match be done that easily. Dude, I got to give props to these two. They are doing exceptionally well. Oh, my God. Big gut shot gotta punch. got to give props to, this, to all these men in this match. I'm giving more props to Adonis and Bugrip because I expected fucking Super and Titan just to destroy these two. But holy shit, they are proving everyone that they can be a legitimate tag team once again. Oh, yeah. Oh wow, big slap to the face, hitting them with a fucking snake eyes to their corner. Now just stomp. Stomping and it's a little bit of choking. Madonna's oh. there. Choke me, daddy, what? Okay, no, bad. You're fine. <laughs> You're fine. You're fine, $10,000. And we're stripping you of the tag team titles. <laughs> God damn it, Shane. I'm getting sick of that. Go! The Super Uranagi! Off of Adonis, but still not nowhere close because the. <laughs> yeah, Big Whip's still up. <laughs> Jesus. Oh my God. Is he, yeah. is he gonna hit it's it back to back? There's no way. No balls. Super is trying to go for probably another big move, but Don is sh showing some fight in him, not giving up. Adonis is not the type to give up. <coughs> let's let's right now, remember how 
he was able to dodge those patented frog splashes from Mercado. Right now. Oh, it's, oh my god, Buu was trying to take some offensive, but immediately Super just throws him down. Now Titan's back oh. into the mix. Back to the fold. Titan is the fresher man in uh, domination. Yes, I said the actual name this time. Honestly, I don't know who who would. Yeah, no. Honestly, I would say Domin uh, Titan is actually the less hurt one compared to both competitors in domination. I want to be. Oh, oh dear God! It's bang. Yeah. Well, right now it looks like Titan might be cementing the win here because Adonis is out. I mean, it is quite possible, but. I don't know, man. I don't. I don't, I don't want to count you, Grip, and Odonis out. Odonis. Yeah. Odonis. His name's Odonis. I don't. Oh, Odonis. His name's Odonis now. No, no. <laughs> <laughs> Super tried to go for a big boot, but he failed. Yeah, That's now really Bugrip's like. taking advantage of the mishap. Holy yeah, shit, no. whoa, <laughs> Super rolling out, actually getting the advantage over Bugrip, gets him with big shots to the face. Oh, the shot All to right. the head. Oh, my God, honestly, I, now, well, now I'm going for Adonis and Bugrip. At first, I was just thinking Domination was going to win this, but honestly, they're, they're proving they want to win. <laughs> See, and I just want to say, I'm sorry for the amount of tag team matches and how long they've been. Blame yeah, no, the ta me. yeah, no. This is why I, I don't think uh, if we ever do an actual like Bond <laughs> big show <laughs> to where it's full tag team show, uh, we would have to really cut down the matches. Because <laughs> oh, uh, yes. yeah, yeah, the tag that team matches take a while. Some of your favorite yeah. tag teams might not show up. Sadly. No. And now Bugrip looks like he's just talking shit to Titan. Yeah, no, that's, that's Bugrip. That's Bugrip for you. He's a shit talker Bugrip, sometimes. Like, when is Bugrip and or Titan not talking shit, though? I would say just Titan and Super in general. They just talk shit like crazy now. Titan used to not be like that, but, right. uh... Huh? Titan, oh, they, like, they kind of have the right. One. The oh. accolades. Uh, a little bit, yeah, but with that said, not though, I mean, Titan wasn't if, like that when he came they in. Can, if they can defeat Adonis and Bugrip here tonight. Wouldn't that oh. put them on a path for the Well, Titan just games? saved Super from uh, possibly big fucking danger right there. Oh, immediately goes with a pin off of Bugrip. Is that enough to put him down? No, Adonis was able to come and save up. it, but but now gets thrown outside by Super. Oh my god, big snap. Dear God. <laughs> <laughs> we wanted a tag team division, they said. The tag team division would be fun, they said. It'd be fucking great, they said. They said, more like Shane said. <laughs> Let's be honest. Alright, Titan sends Bugle to the ropes. Oh, doesn't connect whatever they're always going for, but gets caught in a Bugle out of nowhere! <laughs> out of nowhere. <laughs> oh, that was funny! Oh, a Bugle out of nowhere! Not gonna lie, like. Breaking fourth wall, I was hoping for this, since it is a certain move. <laughs> oh, oh, no. oh yeah. Bugup. I think Bugup's trying to go for a big splash, but keeps getting fucked by it. Uh oh. Shut the fuck up, Rocky. <laughs> and now, another Titan fall! A Titan uh, this fall? Is, yeah, it's, it's, not, it's not gonna happen, because it's fucking who's, getting done. <laughs> who's move, whose move was that about to be? And he was like, no. Oh, the, the countless people. <laughs> Everybody the wanted the fucking thing. <laughs> but who's the latest? The legend, Diamond Dallas Page. Wait, who was the first? Who was the latest? Oh, Randy. that's a. That, I was gonna say that's Randy. a tie. <laughs> that's a tie. Oh. oh, big belly to belly. One day, one day, gentlemen. That's this match will end. <laughs> One day this match you, will end. You think so? <laughs> I'm yeah. hoping. Fight oh, forever. Oh, yeah. Fight Adonis forever. drop off a Titan. 
No, still doesn't get it. <laughs> what if they fight? Like, like, what if this match really does go on forever? <laughs> <laughs> we'll never, we'll never see the end, guys. We'll never, we'll never see the end. <laughs> Fight for it. Ah, uh, twenty hours uh, uh, later. All right, super going for the pin off of Adonis. One, no, <laughs> be <Bugum's> still there. Jesus. <laughs> no, no, A superhero At doggy. Least <laughs> One, two. Oh, oh we two. got to, we got through a two. We got close. We got close to an ending. <laughs> oh my God! Super well, guess what? <laughs> Just like real life, it's gonna go on forever, and you're gonna have to wait. Oh look, eight. Hey, Bugle just did his own fucking thing to him. Nice. I don't wanna. Forever. There is no. Oh wait, wait. Kian's on straight to the face of Super. <laughs> But Titan coming in again to save the match. Buga, fuck him up! <laughs> oh, wait, there it is. There it is. Adonis getting Titan with a big snap suplex. Oh, what's Adonis? Is Adonis looking to end this match here? Is he? Nope, he's heading into the corner. <laughs> I'm sick of one day, one day, one day. God damn it, I was hoping that was. Oh my god! Oh my god! Oh my god. Dude, he fucking murdered him with the big. Oh my Jesus. god! Adonis is oh dead. my He's fucking dead. god! Dude! He just, he just fucking rolled! Oh Man. my god! You done it now, you done it that now. big boot came so fast, he didn't even <laughs> see it. Dude, that fucked up Adonis. He's struggling Mother. to get back in it now. Faster than a Mach two. My God. Jesus, man. He's, that was the dirtiest dead. one I've probably ever seen. I'm not gonna lie. God. That, 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 came, that, that, that came and went quicker than Michael Slade at a bar on a Friday night. What the fuck was okay? Super, super had so much confidence in Titan that he went for a full on <laughs> around the world shit. What the fuck was that? <laughs> Titan was like <laughs> around the world. Around the world. Oh, I can't do that. No, <laughs> come after me. Oh, oh, oh! It's okay when Hunter does it, but when Shane. No, it's not it. okay no, when I do it because I stopped bad. myself. Yeah, I just fucking shit. stopped bad myself shit. right now. Uh -oh. All right. <laughs> the computers are trying to end the match, dude. <laughs> They're legitimately trying to end the match. They're just too stupid to know how to end the match. I hope they fix this in, in, in 2K20. <laughs> oh my god. Imagine One day. That in 2K20. You are uh, you want to know something crazy? Huh. What? You grip cool didn't break that pin. Odonis actually kicked out of that one. Odonis. Well, honestly, same thing with Titan Adonis. with that Adonis drop, cause uh, yeah. <laughs> I think every, I think all I think all four of these competitors are just so tired to the point. They At this point, oh shit, Buke out of nowhere! Oh wait, Super's not going out. One, two. Damn it! <laughs> I was hoping he was gonna fuck up. Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! Damn it! At this point, quit the match and simulate it. Oh, no. Oh. No. Oh. Oh. Goes for the unforgivable! Is that enough one? No. I mean, it probably is, but Super's just there. Super's just there to save it. Just super, super, you know? Super, super. Just take out the other man, dear God. Uh, <laughs> this match is Hey, Shane, remember back in the day when you were asking for tag team matches? <laughs> What? <laughs> you remember when you were asking for tag team matches like crazy almost every fucking week? You wanted them now? <laughs> he, that's, that's a funny story. He genuinely was. He was asking almost like every week for a tag team match yeah, finally. Was. Yeah. And then uh, finally we give him what he wants and it's it's not what he wants now. <laughs> what? Two. Wait, wait! Oh, oh shit! Oh shit! They just picked him! Adonis and Bill have just picked the MTW World Tag Team! What? They did it! They fucking 
did it. Oh my god. fucking god! Thank you, the Lord above. This is me for them, though. Ah, uh, I generally have no idea. Does this mean they get a shot at MTW gold? I, I generally don't know. <laughs> I'm being honestly, I, I generally don't know, cause uh, I, I don't think they've had. I don't. I de they never talked to me about contracts. W. So I don't know. Holy shit! I think this shit goes to show. That they're ready to fight. Damn. Either way, ladies and gents, it is now on to our second Extreme Rules match or correction, extreme hardcore match. Rules match. It's not Extreme Rules. Match. It's a hardcore match. Same fucking Base. concept. Anyway. Ooh. Quiet, Mr. Outcast. Anyway. So with that said, it is tonight. It is Jack Flo going one on one with Michael Slade. Now, here's the thing: if if Michael Slade loses again. Oh. Y'all guys are going in with no fucking momentum at all into fucking Rush. Probably. So, See, with that said... This is something that you don't understand about the War Machines. Diva with Michael Slade... You know, yeah, sure, the momentum helps, but we go in there with the mindset that every day is a new battle. Every I day is a new war. I don't know Yes, Jack Flow. Honestly, we haven't heard or seen a lot from Flow the past coming for these uh, past you weeks. You will feel the flow. This is all he's pretty interested in. Pretty much, yeah. We don't talk about that uh, thing with the uh, <laughs> wolf back. We don't talk about that. And his uh, voice. <laughs> Honestly, maybe that's maybe that's why we haven't seen him. Maybe he's been contemplating on uh, how far they went the war against the wolf pack. Let's remember, Jack if, uh... Flo. Jack Flo isn't a man that wanted to hurt people. Yeah, that's true. Well, no, we mean like in the level that Shane's been going. Flo's more oh, yeah. like sense. I don't want to say sensible because it sounds like you're stupid. But he's more um. I'm not tuned I'm down. Not there you go. Special. <laughs> Fucking let's insane. Let's remember here. Let's remember here. He's a he's a technician. He's a specialist. He likes to submit people and make sure the match doesn't go on longer than it needs to. Now the question is, can he do that against the likes of Michael Slade here? That's a good question. Cause here's, here's the thing, uh, y'all guys always say he's the John Cena of PXC. I'm slowly being like convinced of it, but it's gonna still take a lot more for me to officially confirm he's the next one of that type of status. <laughs> what do you mean? I already can't see you. Oh, it's because he's in camo, isn't it? <laughs> you can't <see> it. <laughs> Guys, there's music on. I don't see anybody in the ring. What the hell is the camera's pointing to? There's nobody here. Why, like why, 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 why are the ropes moving? Why is the ring shaking? Guys, <laughs> I think this place is on it. Oh. Maybe. God damn it, you can't have shit in Detroit. We're not actually in Detroit. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> what the fuck? That's right, people. PXT is based out of Detroit, Michigan. Yeah, you can't have shit in Detroit. That is right, ladies and gentlemen. Hey. I don't know where we're stationed. <laughs> and, this, and this episode of PXT is brought to you by the War Machines, where the ass whoopings always Shut happen. Shut the fuck up. Shut the fuck up. <laughs> oh, shit. <laughs> and, remember, and remember, don't take this ass whooping personally. It's just business. Yep. Yeah. The f I'm so the lost. Point where the <laughs> gone, I think this rivalry with the Outcasts and War Machines has gone really personal. Uh, uh, honestly, I, I would it's say it's gotten personal for Shane. Yeah, Shane's the only Flo one making this personal. Anything. Flo's kept his mouth shut about it. A, a good majority of everything that's happened between both teams. Um, with that said, though. 
Flo's still not gonna hold back, I would assume. Mainly because, I mean, it's his first tag team gold or his first gold in PXT in general. I would assume he would want to try to keep that, especially Let's against a here. team like the War Machines. Flo, Flo is one hell of a, a fighter and one hell of a technician. This man oh, isn't gonna give up so easily. But not the man like Michael Slade. You know, that's, that's what makes uh, the team of the War Machine so interesting and why that match at Rush is going to be more interesting as well because it is a tag team hardcore match. Elimination. Yeah, tag team elimination <laughs> no. hardcore. You know, you know what impresses me about the tag team of the War Machines? Oh. They did not form that tag team out of friendship. They did not form that tag team out of spite. They did not form that tag team based on any of the basic bullshit reasons that oh, tag came back. was strictly out of respect out of respect that two Look men have for each into. other a brotherhood most definitely and bitches tons of bitches Tons of bitches. Tons of bitches. Like many, many bitches. And, and, like Ava, Ava like a, a crazy ones, like Ava Moreno. And <laughs> Lorraine. And Lorraine. We can oh. announce this now. Lorraine is officially and, part of and the hell. machines as well. And hell. Yeah. And yes. hell. Yes, Especially is. hell. I love going to hell. What? I'm joking about that. I praise the our, just, our, our one just, the devil, just devil just at the door, just like Shane. What the fuck are you doing here? Uh, I need a place to stay. And all, sudden, <laughs> and all of a sudden, the advocate walks in, Michael Wolf. <laughs> oh shit! Um, wow. Hey, well, look at this. Flo showing he's great at baseball too. He just hits him square, but the Wait, head. God damn. Hey, that would be like a badass you know. day for Devil's finish. What? The devil's advocate. Devil's advocate. Yeah, bro. I, I feel like that. I feel like that would be uh, the tag team name, or like Whoa. the tag team uh, finisher. Slam by slow. Ooh, Oof. yeah. Shades of. Uh, yeah, like if he's involved with the tag Henry. team finish, it'd be devil's advocate. Yeah, that's pretty cool. I like that. Ah, uh, horse what rocky had to play on the Henry part of it. Yeah, right what? now. The world's the world's strongest slam. <laughs> was made popular by the man Mark Henry. But Flo turned it into his own thing. Wait. No. Oh, wait. Oh, oh, oh. Flo got caught in one final oh. verdict. One verdict. Oh. Uh -oh. Well, we are about uh -oh. to see uh -oh. a double uh -oh. verdict here. Is that enough? Not, that might one, not be enough. Two. No. Flo says a lot. Oh, Slade wants to show like everyone Flo. how he is at baseball. He's fantastic at it. Oh, yeah. No, Slade played baseball in Oklahoma. Oh, well. Well, he no. was until fucking Flo just got his legs. Flo's trying to break his ankles. Break his ankles! Oh, <laughs> shit. Yeah, break them ankles. The wrestling fan in me just kicks in. <laughs> oh, shit. My God, series of punches. Punches enough to bust open the likes of Jack Flo. Oof. Oh. All right, Slade no, looking, <laughs> Slade's looking for more toys. Well, Slade was looking for more toys. Flo interrupting and now catches them into. Oh my God! What the fuck? What is that? Wait, hold on. Let's see. Uh, I, I actually forgot the name of that move, but he turned it into a submission hold. He oh turned God. it into a suplex. My arm God, break. damn! The technical oh, work off a of fucking Jack Flo. The technical work of Jack God. Flo is almost amazing to watch. That's, oh. I think that's actually a first that I've actually seen from him. I've actually never seen him pop anything like that. It's still just a beautiful move he can take Flo, out. Flo knows that he's going to need a lot more to put down the likes of Michael Slade. And Slade knows he's going to need a lot more to take he's down the likes a, of Jack Flo. Hey, uh, Cyclone, your controller Jack battery is low. Oh. I know. I'm hoping that, I'm hoping <laughs> it doesn't die in the middle of this, uh... Middle of this match, because I, I had the other one ready. I just want to add that neck breaker was right on the still on chair, and Slade gets up. Do you feel that like that D Mob has 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 gave Slade tips and tricks in hardcore matches? I think Shane has given a few tips to Flo about giving concussions. Holy shit! 
I don't know. Like I said, I, I don't feel like Flo is as far as deep as what Shane's been going as of weeks. And this episode is, uh, this episode of PXT oh, is brought to you busted. by the hospital, where all of the PXT superstars will be after this show. <laughs> Pretty much. Awesome. And right now, oh, oh wait, oh, Slay was trying to go for a final verdict, but Flo, go getting out of it. Flo, oh. yeah, Flo got well, Flo out. Flo hit the flow of motion. Oh, 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 oh my god, dude, the exceptional work from this man, holy shit. Dear god. Flo has exceptional. Flex. Is the War Machines going to lose before Rush is going? Then they going win. Maybe. Yes. <laughs> Shoulder whatever, tackle. Whatever that It'd be pretty cool. All right now, the flow. Oh, flow! Look, locking in the flow of motion of Michael Slade, oh. looking to make the man tap out. Oh my God! He might tap. Ah, uh, Jack Flow has made Michael Slade tap out here tonight. Jack Flo just made the, the MTW Intercontinental Champion tap out. Wow. Holy Wow. Right now, right now we're catching an right now we're catching an interview with uh, D Mob. D Mob, uh, the fuck? <laughs> Oh fuck up like the the fuck. I don't know. I don't I, don't, I, I generally don't know. I hear real quick. Uh I don't know if this controller is fully charged. I'm gonna hope it is, but uh maybe, if not, maybe then we just might be a little fucked. Just caught Michael played off guard. Like uh, I'm not exactly sure fully. what happened there. Ah, uh, not fully, but you're you're charged. You're charged enough. Maybe he Maybe he underestimated Jack Flo just a little bit. Maybe, but I mean, I mean, this looks bad for y'all though, because y'all guys like have no momentum going into this. That's what's really gonna hurt y'all. I mean, when the day comes, the only thing that the outcasts need to know is that the that that the war machines are not just coming into that match. Just as another match, they're coming into that match as if it's war. <sighs> I don't know. Good luck to you, man. Good luck to y'all. But now, ladies and gentlemen, it is on to uh, something that Mike Evans has been uh, uh, for recently. Recently, these past weeks, Mike Evans has been doing open challenges to prove his worth. Uh, last week, he did come up short against a former two-time PXC champion, Bone Tubular. Two <laughs> now, with that said, um, can he regain that momentum? Because this thing, he is officially in our PXT rush match. Ugh. Is, who else is going to be in that rush match? <laughs> the rush yeah. match is a 30 man uh, Royal Rumble type match. Yeah, we know. But we were yeah. just seeing likes of the outcasts and or the war machines in that match. That is an excellent question. I have no fucking idea. <laughs> Anybody can come into the into the rumbleish match, I guess. Into in the words, uh, match, Rocky. In other words, I will have to make an actual thing and then uh I'm not gonna unveil who's in what. Like what spot, because that's just pretty much gonna say, oh well, who won it? Um but I will see on setting up an actual thing. You can actually do it random. No, don't yeah, do it random. Because then there's gonna, a chance it, of other of real guys showing up. Yeah. No. No, 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 no. You can still, like, you can still, like, like, uh, even, uh, Lance knows how to do it. So if you need help with it, uh, because that's what Lance did for his. Oh, yeah, but no, I do, I do want to do it like how WWE, I do want to do it like how WWE does it. So I'm going to try doing that. Um, and actually, like, yeah. modifying it like that. So that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, you can. And, and, and I, know, I know, but that's, I know, that's, I know, but that's, that's what I'm saying, though. That's what I'm saying, though. <laughs> I'm going to do that, yeah. And it okay. looks like yeah. the man to answer the call is on, not only D-Mob, but is AJ Cannon. <laughs> what the commentary team is calling the chosen ass of PXT. Hey, 
He's the cho he's the chosen one. <laughs> chosen one for what? Good fucking question. <laughs> Now Cannon, Cannon has, Cannon has also named his place in the PXT Rush match as well. So in other words, he will be in that match. But the question is, at what spot that is? A beautiful question that we do not have the answer for right now. No, I don't even know. I haven't made it yet. That said, though, I mean, shit. Honestly, I, I would say he's one of the contenders I have going for in that match. I would say he'd be one of them because uh, I think I think he can actually pull it off. Who knows? He might be, he might be the chosen one for BXC Rush match for Marino. Mm, sadly, no. <laughs> Yeah, so in other words, uh, the people that are fighting for the titles will not be in there. Now, such as the tag team titles, yes. Um, hardcore champions, TikTok champions, yes. Um, the pretty much whoever's involved with the main title shot, like the main, main title shot, the PXC title, will not be in there. So Electro will not be in that match. And sadly, Smooth Marino will also not be in that match because they about, win. What about G7 and Satoshi? Oh, shit. G7, mm, uh, that's where I'm also debating on because I'm thinking he should, but at the same time, I'm thinking probably not. We just missed a big old spear from uh, AJ Cannon. Ass. Yeah. Now, this is actually an interesting match because it's a small man going against a very, like, tall like six, competitor. Two, six, five? Yeah, because the goddamn, well, the size well, let's difference. Let's be honest here. Mike Evans has taken on some big, big competitors. Mike That's Evans, true. He, he was able to put down. Uh, he was able to put down Draven. Honestly, hell, I was surprised on that. He put hell, down I think Draven like all was surprised. Nothing. My God, right now I'm actually impressed that both men are doing a great back and forth against each other. Holy shit! Now we haven't seen AJ Cannon since uh, his match with uh, Gen X. That's true. Honestly, what? AJ. Yeah, AJ wasn't. Uh, AJ has not been in. A lot of PXT matches, honestly. But uh, with that said, though, I mean, shit, this could be his opportunity and his moment but will, at Rush. But I will say this. AJ Cannon, any time he appears, it doesn't matter. He's always putting on a show. You know why? Oh, yeah. Because he's the chosen ass. Man, I'm rooting for AJ and D-Mob for the Rush match. Okay. Yeah, no, honestly, that's, those are pretty good picks, actually. Of course, Drew doesn't say Shane, because why would he? What? No, that was no, that was smooth. That was smooth. That was smooth. That was smooth. Yeah, yeah. Drew, Drew hasn't said who he's going for yet. Oh, well, obviously, no. Drew's gonna go for himself. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But with that said, though, um, I think my picks would, uh, yeah, my picks would have to be AJ. Uh, let's see. AJ and the kid. Because the kid, he's he has won matches constantly, but he has not gotten opportunities like at all. Well, that's <laughs> and, what makes uh, the kid so angry. Yes, yeah, so that's why I think that's why I think maybe Rush can actually like push him far to where maybe maybe he can actually like get the title shot he rightfully thinks he deserves. I feel like he does deserve it. He's taken down accolades. He took yes, down he multiple has. stuff, such as beating. Bill Cassidy before he became Bill Cassidy. I mean, that, that, I mean, 50 50. <laughs> I feel like I said a lot of people, though. Oh, shit. Huge tombstone pile driver right there. Is that enough to put down? Uh, wow. No, it was not because the long legs of Mike Evans saves him. Jesus. Those were not underneath the roof, Evans. Yeah, you're, you're old to the point where you're getting blind. What do you mean? There's the ref. Look at his hair. He swore oh, he saw his feet underneath the ropes. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I try, man, but he keeps popping up. <laughs> yeah, because you don't know how to not put him in. No, I generally have changed it numerous times. Even when I made the show, it's not supposed to be that ref, but for some reason, he keeps coming back. 
What about that woman? What about that one woman we had? That's who I said. <laughs> but for some reason, it's always this old fort, and I have no idea why. Like, I genuinely don't know why this old man. Okay, we're not gonna talk about that. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> What? He missed the full on like elbow dive. <laughs> oh shit! Big running knee. One, Ooh. two. Holy crap! Shit. Damn. I love how we've been somewhat this ignoring this here. match. <laughs> Honestly, I, I'm impressed how both men are actually like. Going back and forth. It's a good back and forth you know between what? the two. John Winters against this old fart of a ref. <laughs> oh, I wish I fucking could. Oh shit! That uh, I think that was just a regular splash. A splash. splash. <laughs> no guys, no guys, confuse me and concern me. Oh, what's what's Evans going for here? Well, Hunter, you confuse me and concern. What's me, Evans so. going for here? What is he doing? Oh, oh shit! Evans, oh. Evans, One! Evans. Two! Two! Uh, shit, what do we call that? I, I generally don't know what to call that. Interception, because he's a flip, but what? <laughs> God what? damn it. <laughs> we call it field goal. <laughs> what? 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 No, it's it's good. Shit. It's good, that's the name of it. It's good. Ooh, it looks like AJ Cannon might pick up the win here. No, surprisingly, it doesn't. And right now, it's still. Like I said, I'm very impressed. Oh, that was a good no, back look, and forth. Oh my god! That is the chosen. That is the chosen one ass. All right. The chosen ass. The chosen ass. Wolf is the of PXT. Ass. Oh yeah, Michael Wolf is the I gotta give props to. I gotta give props to Mike Evans though. Him actually like doing actual like open matches has helped his career a lot really and especially yeah. and especially that his nfl season is over god fucking damn it <laughs> especially with him being on my the god <clears throat> yeah i'm telling you mike mike evans has is starting to like just plain up shock the world I'm here in you, pxc man, man. I'm, I'm just He's happy that mike YouTube evans champion. is here I he is the next YouTube channel. The only thing I'm upset about is that no more BFT. <laughs> no. More Honestly, more. I'm not gonna no lie. I wish he did keep that because the mic satisfaction was so fucking good. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> what? Wait, has Mike Evans ever gotten mad at the football jokes? I don't think so. Mike Evans is in a as far as I know, bitch. he hasn't told us anything. Oh, look at that. Someone isn't getting mad at the jokes. Listen, getting man. mad at Cut. the Mike, jokes. God Mike damn Evans it, are we doing no this again? Bitch. Mike Evans oh, ain't no bitch. Wait, here it is. Here it is. Mike setting oh, up. Cannon, once again. Hit, Can he hit the field goal? He's gonna do it. It's good. Field goal. He calls oh, it man. the look at my dick. No, so yeah. <laughs> hey, <laughs> and hey, picks up a one. win. Oh, <laughs> yeah. That was Evans. straight. That was straight down the middle. Right there, straight the down the middle. Yeah, you know what? Straight down the middle is actually a really good one. We'll go with that. <laughs> Mike Evans. Mike Evans with a straight down the middle. Straight Let's down the middle. Let's go Evans. Let's go Evans. We'll call it the SDM. There you go. SDM. Yeah. SDM. It's a, it's a simplified yeah. version of it. You mean SDM? Yeah. But, uh, well, SD but, but I'll, tell, I'll say it like this, Mike, if you're watching, please bring back Mike's satisfaction. Please, please. It's, so, it's such a good move. That or keep keep that one and have what's it called as like a backup, because that would be pretty cool. Yes. Because yeah, that, that one was actually, because like, I really did like Mike's satisfaction. The, it was a cool Mike's satisfaction. Alright, oh, I'll be on to our main event this is, this is the main event, and uh, this is a match that is being revealed right now. These guys don't know Come anything on, about it. But I'm being honest with you, Mox might be dead here. Come on, Mox. We don't know. We so, know for people. We don't know <laughs> real quick. So, for people who don't know how the PXT <gasps> TikTok and Hardcore Championship. Know. Hold on. <laughs> for people who don't know how these two titles work the PXT Hardcore and TikTok Championship, every week they are defended and it is a randomly selected opponent. We count to 30 and then that is the opponent. 
So, this week, <laughs> Mox, Mox might actually die because he Mox. is going against none other than d -Mom. Wait for the fucking announcement! <laughs> <laughs> Desert flood. <laughs> Desert flood. <laughs> oh my god. God damn it. Oh my god. Oh my god. God damn it. Mox. 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 Fuck. Is going. Fuck. To die. <laughs> Get over Box, it, Box is going to fucking die, man. <laughs> Box's yeah. title reign is fucked. Alright, let's get into it. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, this match is for one fall. It is a hardcore match for the PXC Hardcore Championship. He Son of a whore. I like Desmond, but I also like Mox. God damn it. Oh, for... Bro, the door just appeared out of nowhere. This is proving his mystical abilities. Oh my god. Oh, dude. Speaking of mystical abilities, we also know who else has mystical abilities. This has nothing to do with it. Oh, yeah. Right now, right now, we're probably looking at a murder. My penis, my penis has mystical abilities. Oh, yeah. Oh, uh, my I god. to approve something. Sorry, that will be later, but right now we're going yeah, to hell. <laughs> I don't want to see Box die, man. He's my bogey. <laughs> he might not. Who knows? He might shock the world. Oh my god. His thing, man, there's only been two people to push Desmond to the fucking limit. And that's fucking... That's been Rocky Mercado and C. Jill. C. Jill's the only man that beat him. Maybe Mox will be able to do what his partner could and put him down. I mean, this. I mean, this time around, he's gonna have weapons and shit. So yeah, but fuck. Yeah. Yeah. What? Yeah. Oh yeah. 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 Dude, Desmond is going to kill Mox, dude. Oh my god. The man came back literally last week and fucking decimated. Kill. Fucking decimated Draven, and now he has been Draven randomly could, selected. Draven could not do shit in that match. Oh. Oh. oh, he's so fucking dumb. And he's got the lantern that he's gonna shove up his booty hole later. Oh they both my god! Right back. I have to take a leaky, leaky break. Oh my god, dude! Can you dig it, sucker? sucker. And with that, we got copywritten. Well, thank you, ladies and gentlemen, for watching PXC. Uh, we are now canceled. No, I'm talking. <laughs> My God, dude, Desmond's gonna fucking kill him, man. You don't Desmond's. Know that. You don't know that. Ah, shit. We've seen him struggle with small competitors. This. <laughs> I don't know, man. Flood. Flood is know. like a. <laughs> I guess, I guess we can say one man's lucky he didn't have to face him, and that's Shane Henry. Oh my god, dude. Do you know who can't face him at all? Yeah, dude, I, I, love how, I love how Desmond has already built a fucking thing, like The Undertaker at this point. And your guy will be back where he started. Dude, I love how we've already put Desmond up there with like the Undertaker when it comes to like intimidation. Cause we already, we already dead. think, correction, I'm already dead. thinking Mox is fucking dead. dead. And now D-Mob tagged me in and now I have to take a leak. Oh man, dude. Dude. Oh god. Hey, he tackled hey, the mic. Hey, it's me. It's me. It's the D-M-O-B. B. As our hardcore champion, dude, this Coming might be the. the I, I this. feel like this might be the last time we see him come down this ramp with that BXT hardcore championship. I, I agree because I, I do not see Mox 
uh, being able to go it toe to toe with it Desmond. It is Fox's last ride down that ramp with that PXT championship. Now, there's somehow, some way he wins. I'm not gonna lie. I'm probably gonna yell. I'm gonna be like, oh my god! I'm, I'm gonna you fucking freak out. I dude. don't want to see this. I'm gonna go make noodles. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god, dude! I'm gonna, I'm gonna go. Oh, make fucking hell! No. -uh. I'm gonna go make this. No, Oh man, dude. Desmond's gonna fucking kill him. I love you, raw tacos. Ladies and gentlemen, our main event. All right, let's get I'm into not it. Fat. I'm big bone. Let's it's get fluffy. into it. Let's get into it, gentlemen. No. Let me do the okay. announcements. Let me do the announcements. To the ring announcer. Introducing first, the challenger, Desmond Flood. <clears throat> and his opponent. He is the PXC World Hardcore Champion, Max! Stop yelling, you scared! We are fucked! <laughs> well, it's no. stopped. Well, it's stopped oh, dude. <laughs> oh, man, dude. This is gonna be fucking wild. Oh, fuck. Oh, fuck. Man, dude, this is gonna be insane. Open the floodgates and turn on oh, the floodlights because this is about oh. to be a shutout. Oh no! This now here's the thing. Mox is exceptional when it comes to hardcore matches, but with that said, dude, he's going against a dominating force who's only lost once here at PXT, man. Shit! Shit! Oh, Flood was trying to get advantage, but now there it is, Mox showing no fear against the likes of Desmond. Mox, Mox, Mox. <laughs> Honestly, I legit don't know who to go for in this one. <laughs> I like them both. Why do that's I feel like Cyclone's issue. over that's, here just saying fucking buy his fucking why. nails? That's why I oh don't my want to God. look at this, and that's why I wanted to go make noodles. <laughs> oh, but Mox, Mox knows he needs. Mox already thinking of getting an equalizer, <laughs> and immediately hits Rose Desmond okay. with a table. Oh, this is the continuation of the onslaught, and now Desmond. Oh, nom, getting it. Nom, nom, nom. This would, honestly, like I said, Desmond has only lost once here in PXT. <laughs> it, is the, it is his only loss here in general. It's not just that. It's just his pure athleticism and power and his weirdness. Especially it's, with that slingshot clothesline. And how we just hit Mox with a roundabout neck breaker. And how he can just lift you up and send you back down to the canvas. Okay, he went a little bit too far with that, but with that said, you're not wrong. <laughs> but with, with that like, said... Like <laughs> no, but technically you're not wrong, but here's the thing though. This is what makes it more terrifying is that Desmond has only... We've only seen him in one match with no rules, and that was Carnage. And that's what him and CGO fucking laid out. Nothing but pure Carnage. This is another match to where he can do the same. There is no cage. He is unrelenting. So with that said, I mean, what do you do when you put an unstoppable force against a man that will fight his life in every match for that title? I think he's an uns I don't think he's an unstoppable force. I just think he's an immovable object. I think something can move him. It just I think Mox can make him move. Uh, well him in. You, I, you. Uh, I don't know about that. I'm <laughs> I, trying, I generally stuff. <laughs> 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 Both the uh, members of the commentary team <laughs> are refusing to look at this match because they know that this might be the end of oh, Mox's I'm, long I'm title reign. I'm watching. I'm watching. <laughs> My just, God. I'm trying, man. My commentary <laughs> is not as good. 
team. <laughs> no, you're not that bad. <laughs> you go a little far with it sometimes, but you're not that bad. <laughs> no, but in all in all honesty, though, I mean, shit. Mox is a. Uh... Mox is taking some blows, I think, because I just noticed his chest is all fucking red. It's. Uh... Yeah, Mox is fucked. Oh, wait. Oh! Is Desmond with a big maneuver right there. That's the one thing I will give props to Mox when it comes to the hardcore championship. He makes the matches actually hardcore. Mox, it's not just. Fall. That's what that's called. <laughs> I think. Yes. Oh, and Mox coming in with the equalizer with the kendo stick. I think that's enough to put Flood out. Gets a two count. Gets a two count. That's some signs of hope right there. That's some minor signs of hope. And immediately continues that, the, the onslaught. Oh shit. You just said and the keyword there. Minor. Oh and god damn it. <laughs> and now 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 both men just trading the fucking kendo stick at this point. Here you go. No, I don't want it. Here you go. Oh! Oh my god! And now getting Mox with drowned in the deep! Oh will Mox drown! Doesn't doesn't go for the pin though! Oh now the Oh wait wait! Wait, well, wait, I was gonna say that doesn't matter in this match. He was trying to go for a sneaky pin there. <laughs> Desmond, thinking smart, realizing that there is technically no rope breaks in this match. He can shoot. He, he can quote unquote. Oh! He wants, a bulldog! Face first into the ladder! That oh. is Mox for you! <laughs> Dear God. Oh, wait. Desmond, though. Oh god damn! Hits him with a big stomp. Oh, he's trying to get him with a kendo, but Mox not done! Mox, as I said, he treats this every town offense as its last, and now he's going for a counter mutilation submission hold off of Desmond Flood! Or are we gonna see Flood going tap to? out? No, yeah, Flood turns over. Oh yeah, I think that was straight jacket. No, that wasn't straight jacket. <laughs> Alright, Flood though, still not done. And now goes for a pin off Mox for the whoop title. Oh. No, doesn't get it. He I don't think Flood understands how crazy Mox is. Oh my god. Yeah, his thing, Mox has limits too. Now with that said though, can Mox put down the man? A man like Desmond Flood. Oh wait, here it is! Asylum oh. to Desmond Flood for the title oh. one, two. No, Flood kicks out. But here's the other thing. I don't think Mox understand how crazy Flood is. I feel like these two can just go back and back and forth all day, and it just could be just a hell of a match. I mean, honestly, that goes both ways. Both men don't realize how th how much the other is willing to go or how much the other... Not even willing to go for a title for Flood. Flood just wants to deal with punishment. That's all he wants to do. To whereas Mox is seeing his life in this case. Like, the Hardcore Championship has awakened something in Mox that, honestly, I don't think I've seen in him in a very long time. Mox also might be fighting for his brother in arms, Rocky Mercado, or how I don't know how to say it. Uh, even since he's out and injured right now. Uh, I don't know about that part. <laughs> like I, said, I, think, I, think, I think Desmond Flood just got busted open. Yes, yeah, so Flood. I think Flood did get busted open, and that might have <laughs> sealed the fate for Mox here. If 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 Zach if if if, if he's anything. Like how, if his anger is oh! like Johnny's. Oh, what the fuck? Flood just popped out some brass knuckles. Who? Oh, he knows this is. He knows this is anything it's, goes. It's so it's yeah. It's, it's all legal. It is all legal. But Mox he takes it like a champ thing. though. But he hit his head right there on the apron and ring post, so we don't know if that'll affect him. Uh, honestly, Mox has had. God damn, Mox has had so much fucking damage done to his head. I'm more impressed he's still okay with these type of matches. I think I don't know if Flood's okay with with his head, especially with Ooh. that bulldog right to the face. Oh, all right. 
Oh, wait. Oh, oh. Flood, looking. For a submission Ooh. hold off of Mox, looking to probably just wear down the hardcore champion. Here's the thing. Electro has done the same thing in the past, but that shit needs to happen in the ring if you're going to do that. It does, but he's just wearing him down to see if he taps, and he's, if he does tap, he might just go for drowning in the deep and finish it off. And, of course, he gets out of it because it's Mox. Okay. Okay, yeah, a little too much, but okay. <laughs> That's what I thought. <laughs> <laughs> You're good, man, but no, either way, Mox, though. <laughs> Again, Flood, I guess, yeah, I guess if anything, he is just trying to wear the man down. But even with that said, though, I mean, it still needs to happen inside the ring if he's trying to go for a submission maneuver. Right now, I believe we might actually be seeing Flood. Maybe pushed to his limits once again. Maybe he hasn't fully recovered from Carnage. That's the flood is not doing them submissions to make him tap out. He is doing them submissions to wear him down. Tire his that. opponent. Holy out. shit. Just keep Work the body. Yeah, we, yeah, yeah, we, yeah, yeah, we, yeah, we, yeah, we, we said that like five times. <laughs> hey, Mom, how's that, uh, how's that burger? Oh shit, and again catches, well, not again, but finally catches Flood Burned with the good. steel steps. <laughs> And continues to catch him cool. face first with the still steps. And no, I want to point out, I feel like I feel like every time he uses still steps, it ensures his victory here. Well, Stairs is Mox's best friend, even though he doesn't like taking them to the ring. Uh, cool the shit. All right where now. Where does the bike go after the entrance? That's my question. Look, man, we have a we have a rail loyal team here. But they the, know the, what the, to do the with ring it. The crew comes and gets it. Like I said, a well, well oiled team here. I don't know what Mox, I think Mox is trying to contemplate the type of fucking crazy offense he wants to ensure here, but Second comes up short. Uh, as if he wants to right now though, Flood taking advantage, was able to slide under the ring, tripping Mox over. Also, I think there's a lot of- uh... Oh God. Spiritual powers going on here because notice the ladder is Spir on the announcement. <laughs> Wait, is spiritual? Yes. I think you meant I think you meant supernatural. <laughs> he came out spiritual. Yes. Oh. <laughs> I'll say supernatural, baby. <laughs> Look, man, that's that's been flood for you. But as I said, the flood needs to flood, flood needs to do this shit it. in the goddamn ring if he wants to win. <laughs> I just, I, th I think he knows that this won't, it, you, you need a lot more to just take Mox out. I don't think it's that. I think, because here's the thing, I don't see Flood going for titles. That's why I was surprised that uh, when we said he was selected, he went through with it. It's just, he's a strange individual in general to where you really don't expect him to accept shit like this or to do anything <laughs> in general that deals with a title. So with that said... <laughs> Oh, this is oh, that, and now, oh, now, now where it matters most, gets Mox in the submission hold, are we going to see Mox give up the hardcore title here? Who knows? Are we going to see it? No, Mox, as I said, is fighting for his life here and sends Desmond to the outside once again. Keep the thing in the ring. I think Desmond's trying to, but Mox wants the wants the demolition derby to happen on the outside. You've had oh my god. Dear god. It's on the apron. <laughs> I'm 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 Right now Mox Mox getting Desmond back in the ring. He's gonna he's gonna need to do a lot more to capitalize though. And gets caught into the floodgates! Oh no, that's it. One! That's it. Two! No! Mox is still not done! Oh, but what? now gets caught and drowning in the deep! That's, that's, gonna be it. that's it! That is it! One! Two! Three! And with that, three. Desmond Flood is our new PXC Hardcore Champion! Wow, but what a title run by Mox! Honestly, he's, he goes down as our longest reigning hardcore champion. But with that said, I mean, now 
Now, whoever gets elected is gonna have to go to fucking war for that championship. My god. Holy god. shit. It was good though. It was, was actually good. a pretty good match, yeah. I, I Mox was fighting I his you, wife. I told you Mox was gonna fucking lay down in the dirt. Nah, he wasn't. God damn. That was crazy. Mox, that was a crazy Mox ass is gonna match. Fight tooth and nail, because that's what Mox is known for. All right. Well, with that, ladies and gentlemen, that has been PXT. Uh, the final one. PXT. Final one before uh, PXT Rush, which I also want to point out. Uh, that's what's gonna have to immediately defend that title. <laughs> oh fuck. Yeah. <laughs> Remember, all the titles are getting defended, <laughs> so that's Gen X will be defending. Yeah. Gen X will be defending, no and uh, now Desmond will. Dude, whoever's gonna be facing Desmond, y'all are dead. <laughs> Can you imagine that, man? Can you imagine that? Hey, congrats, you just won a title. Guess what? Now you have to defend it. Literally. <laughs> Next week. <laughs> and then they're just like, oh, oh, cool, when? When do I have to defend it? What? Fuck. Only get one week for this shit? Yes. <laughs> All right, but with that, uh, ladies and gentlemen, we're gonna go ahead and end this stream right here, right now, so that we can go on to the call. That's right. But either it took way, it's uh, so long because of these noodles that I made. I have to mm -hmm. make very specifically. So or else I also want to. So okay. But either way, with that said, I also want to point out this has been officially the longest episode of PXT in history. Yes. But with that oh, said, I'm uh, sorry, I have to do. It. <laughs> Yeah. God damn it. <laughs> Alright, well, we'll see you guys in the call in a little bit. Uh, we're gonna have it all set up. But uh, this has been PXT. We'll see you guys uh, next week for PXT Rush, which I also want to point out for confirmed matches for PXT Rush. We have the YouTube Championship between G7 and Satoshi being defended. Then we have the Tag Team Championships being defended in an elimination hardcore match between the Outcasts and the War Machines. Then. Then we have the TikTok Championship and the Hardcore Championship against random opponents, which I will probably reveal in the call. So you guys want to actually come on down and see that. Say it's Return. long live Gen X. Try today matches. <laughs> long live Gen X. That's all I have to say. Long live Gen X. He loses, it, so he loses it next week. He loses it next week. <laughs> I hope. I hope. I hope. But, well, with that said, then uh, we have the PXT Championship between Smooth Marino and, and the one Electro. And then, then to close off yep. that full night will be the PXT Rush Mat. Oh, yep. Yeah. 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 We're we'll gonna do it a little bit of the end of shit. <laughs> 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 Alright <laughs> right, guys, peace out, take care, you have a great night. We'll see you guys in the call in a little bit. <laughs>